the toy mayor himself checking in. The old toy chase here. We got Dom saying hello there. Josh Brown is here. He says third, so we're going to keep that going. Okay. Headrock uh, just finished Helldiver season session, and I am ready to get sweaty with the Sentinels. Don't blame us. That's all I'm going to say for X Men. Um, but uh, Henrock, I do want to say congratulations. We, to we just for picking up your shot, which was yes, uh, which that's was awesome. awesome. Yeah, that's also awesome. We just want to reiterate that we are not. Con- no we sentinels. do not consider ourselves Sentinels. Yes. Yeah. We do Correct. not. We don't want those that that blood on our hands. <laughs> Either or any. Yeah. Uh, Toy Rensu hitting us with the sup noids. And we got Jukebox Hero. Hope you did your proud, Jimbo. Uh, <laughs> had to stop at Home Depot on my way home to pick up about two and a half Danny DeVitos and light to fly with. I'm glad that is sticking. I'm glad that is sticking. And uh, <laughs> we got Paul Morales saying hello, everybody. Jukebox Hero, Toy Rensu. Keep going, keep going. We got uh jason benvenu says yo let's go uh just about action figure saying what goes on here we have no idea what goes on here 796 studio saying sup friends you just left mario behind not too long ago He's, uh, it was also his birthday so ha- wish yes, him a was happy birthday, birthday it was like three in a row right it was like kevin's birthday um it would think it was kevin mario and then somebody else i think was today uh, oh, I think- I think Pon- Ponchisi's birthday was yesterday. Ponchisi, yeah, Ponchisi was yesterday. So, yeah. AZ Toy Hunters Guild is in the house saying, "What's up, everybody?" Uh, Robo toes with the yo yo yo. Fantastic Four saying, "Hey, howdy, hey." Uh, let's see who else we got here. Berserk sixty nine first. Ooh, in our hearts. Here. In our hearts, Berserk. In our hearts. Uh, Brick something is here saying last. <laughs> <laughs> it's just throwing us for a loop. Uh, Uncanny, Uncanny Sculpts is here saying, what up, guys? Have a good stream. Thank you, sir. Matt Logic 44 saying, evening, gents. Got to uh, meet him in Canada, too. Oh, did? Oh, yeah. Um, Kyle the Collector saying, what's up, B2S? What's up, chat? I do want to be mindful of our guests coming in, so we will get to your Canadian adventures very soon. KJ Smith saying, what's up, peeps? We got Messy Photography saying, what's up, J Shot? What's up, Machu? Uh, we got Adam Bradley saying, keep it down. I can hear you from my hotel room. I'm going to slam. I'm going to stop on the floor. You cannot hear me. Uh, I'm below uh, you. I'm tell below him you. I'll put in my timesheet tomorrow. So, um, yeah, please put in your timesheet. I think that is everybody. Oh, Toy Chase says, happy upcoming birthday, Dom. So Dom's got a birthday coming up. Uh, Dom says it's the end of the month. Uh, so there you go. A lot of people in April. What was going on nine months ago that people were just like, let's get drunk and make babies. Um, but anywho. We got lots of people backstage. We got a full backstage here. Who do you want to bring in first? Should we bring in our, our guest host or our special guest? Let's bring in our guest host really quickly. All right. We've got the one and only No Chewing and Toy Father. And I believe the third Toy Daddy is on his way. He is doing some daddy duties <laughs> uh, by putting the kids <laughs> putting the kids to sleep. But uh, other than that, what's, uh, what goes on, guys? What's happening? What's up, guys? How you guys doing? Oh, you no, know, we're managing. We're managing. We're still uh, reading from the episode this morning. Uh, I think Matt. Matt, you said you woke up at like three a.m. to watch it, right? I like, woke up at four day. because I fell asleep pretty early last night. Yeah. And we uh, we do make a promise that we are going to keep it as spoiler free as possible. Um, mm. But uh, you know, there might be there might be some talk, but uh, maybe towards the maybe, end we'll talk about it. Yeah, maybe we'll see. We'll see. And yes, we are doing a little bit of a cross stream here. Matt, you just had a big green flicker. Uh, we had a little bit of a cross stream. We'll see what uh, what's going to happen as far as other people coming in. Like I said, we got nothing. We had nothing planned for tonight, so it's a, it's a little fly by the seat of our pants. And uh, you know, speaking, I don't want to say speaking of pants, but uh, speaking of good things, uh, we do have a brick something and Jason from Spiro Toys are here. Whoa! Well, hello. The hello, 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 hello. What's up, guys? So, How's Star everyone doing? Is- what do we got? We have, what do we, got? we got six days left, right? For you to back this bad boy. About that, yeah. We've got we got streams crossing tonight. We're doing deja vu from last week from both of your guys' streams. Yeah. So thank you both <laughs> to you for helping with the AWOC talk to help gather the tribe and do all that stuff. So yeah. I gotta say, you, you guys are the most impressive. You know, I, I every week when Machu does like five streams in a row, I'm always impressed. But you guys are on week <laughs> three of doing like ten streams a week, and it's it's a <laughs> nice. Awesome. 
High five. It's been great. <laughs> there you go. Oh, it's on the other side. Oh, the other side. You're almost there. You're almost oh, With my sorry, internet sorry. delay, it's not going to happen. Look, here, we'll do it slow. Real slow. Watch. <laughs> yeah, but you're going the wrong way, Fred. You're going the, you're going the wrong way, buddy. Yeah, you are. There you go. Oh, oh I have this mirrored. Sorry. There we go. Three and a half Damn minutes it. of attempted high fives. Um, you set this so, up. <laughs> but you guys got to, I, I, you know, we were messaging this morning, or you were messaging with Matt, and then Brick, you were messaging with me. We got some exclusives that we're going to get to uh, unveil tonight based off of new tiers that have been unlocked and new tiers that are going to be unlocked. So some exciting stuff happening. Where do you want to, yeah. where do you guys want to start? Oh, geez. Um, well, if we could, uh, I'm sharing a screen and I can kind of go through it that way. It'd probably yep. be easiest. And um, forgive me if if this is too fast or if I make people seasick, I'm just going to try and move through because you, as you as you both, as all four of you know, this this Kickstarter is just ridiculous uh, and kicking, stacked. So. butt. Yeah. And I think that's the newest. I just did a copy and paste. Does that does that feel right, Jason? Yeah, that's great. Yeah. Uh, okay. while, while Brick scrolls through to the stuff, I, I will say, yep. you know, we've unlocked everything that we originally showed on day one, except for raving. So that's what we're kind of chipping away at right now in this little, this little uh, marathon part of the Kickstarter. So yep. uh, anyone who's biting their nails, don't worry about it. This is just a normal, this is how all Kickstarters play out. We're going to have a big old giant push in the last 48 hours. So that's right. Just kind of sit back and watch us uh, update all the unlocks that you guys have unlocked so far. And with that, I'll, I'll let Brick take it. Oh, yeah, sure. And, you know, of course, here you go. Here's Mamba. Everybody's been saying, no sleep till Mamba. I was inspired by the Beastie Boys with that one because, you know, they were sitting on that 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 tour and they're like, man, we ain't going to sleep till we get back home to Brooklyn. And we're like, OK, uh -huh. we're not going to sleep till we get to mamba but then we changed it and said oh no we got to go a little further so we can unlock those two guys behind him so these this is essentially going to be the reps of the the pacadine with general mamba in the lead and to his right you've got zwar the rhino the yeah. tattooed rhino and then to his left you've actually got vitus who is also a tattooed hippo but you can't really see that in the can't shot see them just yet general mamba um, and the beefcakes could be a so this could is be a man <laughs> Yep, I this is who we're shooting for. They look great. Actually, and I was excited. The hippo, like at least the rhino had been out, but the hippo is pretty new. Yeah, um, he looks awesome. Yeah. That's a rare. Thank you. Now, what does that bring us to in terms of sculpt counts for these? Sculpt for count two, uh, for oh, uh, new bucks? bucks. Uh, yeah, bucks. Sorry, uh, I think it would be six and seven. Yeah, seven yeah. total. Yeah. Now this is gonna be released over waves. You know, uh, the reptile yeah. and the brawlers are wave one. Uh, the females and the speedsters are wave two. Uh, and then everything unlocked after that will be, uh, you know, wave three and probably a 3.5 or something to that effect. You know, the, the elephant will probably be, you know, uh, delivered on its own. Or, you know, when we unlock the, the elephant, rhino and hippo, it'll probably be its own wave just because of it's like two new tooling molds. Um, and they're going to be big, chunky boys, and uh, we want to give ourselves a little bit of a buffer. So uh, you, you'll get the other stuff sooner, and then this will be our, our third wave. So this is – you saw this before, and as you pointed out, the rhino's kind of been snuck in there for a while but was never sort of like listed as an unlock or whatever. And just uh, – I think it was like this past weekend we officially just said, okay, let's just throw it up there, uh, and we'll get to the numbers in a second. We, I think we talked about this last time, but just, hey, folks, big deal is if you check out that Epic Call In, that's my, that's what I'm rooting for. It's like Whoa. if we can unlock mm. everything planned, this is how it's going to break down if you do the Epic All In. So if you end up buying all of the items that get on, including everything that's unlocked as single items, if you were just like for whatever reason, no, nah, I refuse to take a deal. I'm going to pay for each item separately. Um that would cost you, you can ignore that tab. This is what it would cost you if you paid for every single piece individually, according to the Kickstarter price. And this is yeah. what it would be according to the retail price. If you do the Epic All In package, you're paying $650 instead of that $919, saving yourself about $269 in Kickstarter prices. But if you uh, compare that to that retail price right here, this is what you're yeah. saving, which is nuts. And this is why it's so important. We get that last spike. 
so that it, the epic all is truly epic. That said, that epic, uh, well, yeah, that, right. We'll just leave Brick, it there. We'll leave it there. Yeah. So, Brick, actually, Josh Brown's got a question. He said, will, will epic all in ship in separate waves or will they all come together? Yeah. Everything's going to ship in separate waves. So, uh, okay. the idea is to give, you know, we don't want the backers waiting forever to get one big giant box. They'll sure. be shipping in waves. So, that it goes across the board. If you back for one figure, it'll be part of one of the waves. If you back for, you know, like the Epic all in, it'll be three shipments. If you do the Epic, or if you do the regular all in, which is a fantastic deal, that will be in two waves as well. Now, if you, if you do the Epic, I mean the, the regular all in, and then you decide to add Mamba in backer kit or something like that, or if you add it during the Kickstarter, again, you'll get three different shipments. Cool. I actually think the, uh, you know, if, if you do back the Epic all in and it comes in three separate packages or two separate packages, I believe you said, that makes it easier to digest and hide from your wife as you're trying to sneak. Exactly. So, you can hide it, hide easier. it from the yeah. wife. We'll probably put something like a sticker on it that says, uh, you won the contest, you know, contest oh. winner. <laughs> I was going to say that. Oh, like, that, thing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. that came up last time. And I'm like, why don't we put that in everything for horsemen? You, you got to put that. that in everything. Like whenever people ship stuff out, there should be like a little certificate that says, congratulations. You've won all this free stuff. <laughs> right? I think, Rick, if you do a, if you do a separate $5 donation tier, that will say, <laughs> that will get you a $0 invoice. I think we could get Mamba tonight. <laughs> there it is. Oh, that's great. Let's um, make it happen. So, yeah. And just so you know, you could still do the, the regular all in too, which gets you everything that was originally offered and you're still saving a deal. And I want to like stress that because it's like, if you were just to get the regular all in, which is all the stuff that was originally offered, none of the unlocks, mm -hmm. you're paying three twenty five dollars in the Kickstarter prices. And again, per retail price, that's going to be 460 bucks worth of stuff. So you're still getting about $134 in savings, which I've said this before, and it's no shade at all because I love legions and I buy a lot of that. And I do um, all ins for, for the last two things. And when I've done that, I'm getting the equivalent of, of one uh, regular figure, maybe a little bit more because it's pre-order uh, pre -order prices, but this is huge. This is, I'm just letting people know that's, that's nothing to sneeze at. So yeah. with that said, go for it. No, no, I was just going to, I was just going to, you know, to agree. Yeah. Yes, it's a it's a huge it's a huge savings, right? I mean, like to yep. your point, it's one hundred thirty four dollars. Yep. It's equivalent of what three four figures, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's thirty percent off. If you yeah, think that way. Can no, I just easy. say you, you can do the math? Sorry. Anyways, that's oh, for an earlier. That was an earlier conversation. The phone did oh, okay. the math. I have to that's right. <laughs> can I just say this now. is we like don't need, we don't need math brain. This the math. This table, whatever you composed here, is the most fantastic thing I've seen. Nice. And thank you, Brick. Uh, it's so helpful. And there might be an epic all in in my future. Why, why oh, future? What is it epic? Daddy's going to do epic all in live well, on the future. video. He's yeah, so I feel like it. it's on right now. Me and Machu screen. can split those enabler points because I feel like yeah. he set you up and then the, the chart maybe helped get you over the edge. So. Well, I'm not giving any of this to my. Um, Oh, I think you so. Machu. I, I'm not giving any of this to no chewing. That's what I'm saying. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to do a draft. I'm like, no, this is not. <laughs> that'd, be, that'd be a sweet episode. <laughs> um, I don't know. So anyway, <laughs> oh, these are just here to remind people that this is part of a dope world that Jason and Utama have put out there in comics. And those comics started the same day as um, as this Kickstarter, March 6th. So the, the issue one was basically re-released because originally these were all released independently, self-published and available only through Spiro. But now they're being distributed by Diamond to regular to comic book shops. So March 6th, issue one hit. And then did you ever sort out, uh, Jason, when number two was? Because I know the solicits were due in May, but when will, will um, it be? The so I solicited everything at once. So it uh -huh. should be, uh, if I'm correct, it's May, June, July, August will be the rest Sweet. of them. Um, and I got to tell you, you know, as a as a kid growing up with the previews catalogs and just like just searching yeah. through them, like at, at my time, like there was all these like Japanese import models of like all the Terminator and Giver and Predator. And like they would just I would just just pour over that over and over again. And then I'd like slowly mm -hmm. kind of pick out the comics I want. And like so just like seeing our stuff in the previews catalog just felt so surreal 
Um, the first one that we were featured in, I got two copies and I keep one in my laptop book sack just as like awesome. a reminder. I'm just like, man, we did that. No one can take it away from us. You know, it's just, it's, a, it was a very like bucket list kind of, a uh, event, you know? Yeah. So. Congrats on that, man. You said it models you. and threw me off for a second. It sure. is so cool, man. <laughs> I'm going to, I'm going to break this up just for a second, but because he is wearing a very special, uh, a very, a very special piece of, of garment, I guess. I don't know what you want to call it. Uh, I want to welcome Yimbo reviews everything for the show. Hey, hey. Yimbo. Yimbo. there he is. <laughs> Admantium tasting time, bubs. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, fellas? What's, What's up? up? I didn't recognize oh. you at first. Oh, hey. oh Jimbo. <laughs> Snickety, <laughs> Snickety. Logan reviews everything. Yeah, but you just oh. missed Wolverine. Yeah, <laughs> he was here a second ago. Where was? Take it all the way out. I want to see if you have two strips of hair or no. No, no, no. Oh, I see. I thought you were going to go that way. <laughs> Come on, Yebo, commit. It's, it's, the nice. CM Punk, nice. it's a CRM Punk hybrid. <laughs> Very nice. All right. Uh, I don't break. I don't want to interrupt your flow. So oh, you're good. We're going to go right back to it. Uh, well, we'll, congrats we'll again. Uh, that's awesome, Jason. On that. So this is stuff that we'll just kind of go through real quick. The lizards were the first buck to be um, uh, on the on the sort of list. Again, that's wave one. And then this was the first thing to get unlocked, actually, was this character. So that's unlocked, and that would be part of anybody who got an epic all in. Um, there's just some details on there that I'm not sure what was there or not the last time we were on, but fully articulated jaws, all that good stuff. Check it out on the Kickstarter. Oh, to be clear, you might be confused, but you're like, wasn't it called cold blooded before? We're trying to make it as clear as possible. These are the alt mm -hmm. heads. Yeah. Yeah. For the reptile figures, and they are packed in. You don't got to worry. You don't add nothing. They're just in. Now that we've unlocked them, they're in the box with the figures. Do note, though, that you're getting alternate heads, and that may, for some of us, require us to um, buy additional figures to make use of those heads um no, nobody laugh at my awkward photoshopping of the uh snake heads. no it's good it's good let's look at it <laughs> okay <laughs> so funny no don't move along oh my god that's great that's great King cold, blooded, cold blooded is a great name for those uh for the, the weapons we have a part of the band no it's a great name for a band it should be their band name yeah we're cold blooded and we're oh See? great yeah uh, sorry. Uh, yeah sorry yeah sorry okay. uh hannibal of destruction Go ahead. So an Hannibal um, alternate head. And so Kali alternate head, it says there, Bone Crusher, Grimes alternate head. This was all stuff that was there. And yeah, we unlocked um, Grimes on day 14. Again, that's going to be part of the Epic All In. But what we haven't shown yet were these renders. Um, and this is now on the site. And so you can kind of see these were the original. Uh, so these were the, the illustrations. And this is what they've become. This was just uh, put up today, I want to say, or maybe yesterday. Yeah. Um, so that's today. new. Brick, let me new. say something before you move Go on. Go for it, please. Um, so if you look at the illustrations, you'll notice that both King Hannibal and Kali Prime have those long parts of hair. Yeah. Um, yeah so yeah. whenever you look at the actual figures, that part is a separate part from the head. And so mm. you'll actually see what kind of movement you can get from the head because this is the first time we're showing it separate from i call it the scarf it's just like that longer hair is essentially just resting on the shoulders um so this is a great way to kind of like see the potential for how much movement you'll have with those heads nice right. so, so that head will move but these things will still sort of be hanging down and you can kind of they'll get... just be static yeah, yeah. exactly yeah. so that way they can move back and forth uh, yeah. obviously a slightly limited uh upward movement but it's designed to where it'll kind of like slide over the hair mm -hmm. so i got we got two things here uh thanos captain is thrilled for the grime cigar head very excited to have that unlocked and josh brown actually you know, has a really good question um he says uh he says we know that the epic all is worth it if everything is unlocked do we know what is worth it as we stand with current unlocks may help you new backers uh if they can see its savings now too so I think it's a great question, right? Like, Thanks, Epic Josh. Yeah. as we talked about, was you know it could be X amount of dollars over currently, and we're right. by the way we are we are eleven hundred eleven hundred dollars away uh, as it now stands to to the two forty mark, even less now at this point. Um, yeah, it's less. Yeah, it's about six hundred bucks less. So, 
you know, what, what so, as as we are now, you know, what's 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 the nice. best option? So I want to I want to mention this about the Epic All In. So like the six ninety, we we talked about it earlier. It's definitely worth that. What's so cool about the Epic All In is that it increases in the stuff that you're gonna get, and it keeps adding the value. So, you know, worst case scenario, you're gonna get the six ninety worth of product. Uh, but you know, if we're like within like you know a, a little bit away from like the Mamba figure right before the Kickstarter closes out. Don't panic. You know, we're going to roll that stuff over into the backer kit. So you haven't, we'll have an additional 40 days to like unlock him, you know? So mm-hmm. hopefully that answers his question. The value is built in. It's, it's the 690, but it only increases as we unlock additional stuff. So hopefully that uh, answers his question. So yeah, the further we go, the more value is packed in, but it's yeah. definitely 690 worth of stuff. And if you didn't oh, catch man, that part about the a, backer kit. got a good boost. Thank you. Yeah. I don't know who that yeah. was, but thank you. Thank you to Toy Father. Uh, Toy oh, Father. Toy Father. Thank you, dude. Father, thank you so much. Toy Father back to Epic on that. Oh, yeah. When you're, when you're on multiple streams, that's right. You Good job, Chris. It's a multiplier effect. That was a mistake. No <laughs> back. I don't know how to work the internet. Um, but if you didn't catch that, the backer kit thing. So after the thing, after the campaign closes, backer yeah. kit stays open and if you have backed uh the campaign you can then go in and still pay the kickstarter prices and add more things so there's a little bit that does happen so there'll be a little bit of a bump and then nice. am i understanding this right jason that it'll then be open to others as well but the prices may not be the same as the kickstarter prices correct, correct? Yeah. so, so yeah. what's going to happen is uh so adam's going to launch the backer kit survey It'll be mm-hmm. open for 40 days. So, you know, everyone that backed the Kickstarter will have access to it. They'll be able to pick out all their goodies. They'll be able to add on additional stuff. Um, and then once the 40 days is over, then that that portion of the backer kit will close. And then what we'll do is we'll roll it over to a pre-order model where all the prices uh, revert to the normal MSRP. So, Right now, if a standard figure is uh, $33 on the Kickstarter, it will revert to uh, $38. So just just one figure right there, you're seeing the savings that's built into the Kickstarter. And that's just our thank you you know, to backers and tribe members for getting in on the ground floor. Um, and then, you know, it's 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 comparable to like a NECA figure after that. So, oh, thanks, dude. Oh yeah. yeah D Blake makes his change from all in to an epic all in. So there you go. D Blake, thank you. Are D-Blake you going? Blake. Are you gonna go to Joe Fest? And he's he, can you hear him? No, no. I don't know if he's <laughs> <laughs> I was about to make the same joke. Well, we'll just go, we'll, we'll just sit here till you answer, D Blake. Oh, yeah. look at this. A better shot of those renders. And we haven't shown these anywhere yet. So is we're there, showing them here for the first time. And, during the stream. Oops, you can actually see. Um, the rest of the turnarounds of the other, I'm oh, sorry, the other angles is the words I'm trying to, to say. Um, so this is Hannibal up close. And I will tell you right now, like there are, I, I'm a fan of this line for sure, but, um, you know, I can, I can actually be objective and critical. And one of the things that was really challenging for me is, um, man, I love our, the characters, but, you know, a lot of them have do have kind of like resting or stoic faces and in battle or, you know, in, in photos or interacting with other characters. I want to see alternate expressions. And that's what is now happening moving forward. It seems like all these, every single one of these figures, if we hit those unlocks properly and we did for these guys, we'll have an alternate expression. So you get that Hannibal kind of like staring at your soul and then you'll get this Hannibal about to take your soul. So, <laughs> so yeah, uh, you I know, want to take one second real, real, real quick to just thank Toy Migos for the five dollar super hat. Uh, so hey, what's up, Toy Migos? Part two, appreciate that so much. And uh, D Blake did answer, he says, No Joe Fest for me, uh, too far, but he'll be in Maryland next Toy year Expo in June. So, there you go. Um, um, is that the same thing as ZoloCon? If it's ZoloCon, we'll be there. I would, I have to check. I don't know, I don't know. I literally don't know. Don't, I don't know our schedule. Derek Derek knows our schedule. And he's trying to tell you right now. You just have to listen. A little. Okay. So, I'm going to do it. I, I'm interested. 
Lion is dope. The the, um, the the details on this. This is Dan, right? Yes. Yeah, no, no, no. This is Arlen. Sorry. Oh, Arlen, Arlen did all the brawler bucks. Yeah, this is okay. Arlen. Yeah. Arlen of I Serpentor fame. Yes. I was worried. I mailed his Serpentor and then I was like, did you ever get that? Because it's like a crapshoot sometimes with customs. And he's like, oh yeah, I forgot to mention that I got it. Uh, I had a I had an epic temper tantrum on Facebook whenever that the first pre-order came up because I signed up for uh, to pre-order it and I didn't realize that there was you know the the live date was East Coast so like I tried uh, an hour after and like it was sold out and I was just like uh, and then like three people got it for me and sent it to me and I was like oh now I feel bad <laughs> okay you, you yeah, gotta, so here's you gotta let that you gotta let that energy out so. Uh, oh quick, man, I was I was wanted, heated. B Blake wants to give you guys a huge compliment that says, uh, "Love how much Jason and the team listens to their fans. We've wanted angry faces since the beginning, and now we're getting them. So that is huge. And, and I know that there's a lot more, a lot more to go through. So, uh, yes. yeah, thank you. Yeah. Super hat says, and how rude of me. <laughs> Hello, Toy Daddy. So there's a lot going on. There's a lot going What's on. Up, you know, no one thinks. What's you're going on, man? You know, we got a lot of people here. There's a lot of screens. So uh, you know, we're. We're going to get to everything, but uh, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. All right. All right, Rick, back to you. To I even build wanted- on uh, what Deep Blake was saying about listening to the fans, I mean, one of the – even the articulation that you built into the sculpt is a improvement from the last iteration where pale Thank and you. light, you know, it, it hinders the neck movement. Mm-hmm. So right, this, and that's I'm a really challenge, you know. Uh, you know, that those those – parts of their hair are intricate parts of the design. So it's like, how do you, how do you problem solve? You can only problem solve a certain amount, but uh, I think one of the things that we all like really uh, focus on is just kind of like checking our ego at the door. Look, he's going, he's like, Uh, yeah, you know, whenever, whenever fans point out like really good uh, options, we want to incorporate that as much as possible. And, uh, it was it was past time to start incorporating these uh, grimacing faces, and you'll see uh, they're not all grimacing faces because like some of them have like angry faces. So we'll do the opposite. Uh, and it's funny looking at the cigars. We were kind of debating on like should they have a cigar, and we were like, well, they're coming with like stabbing weapons and firearms. So what are we talking about? Like he needs a cigar, you know? Totally agree. Yeah. Yeah, that, that was my response. And like, you know, I actually I'm not not a smoker at all. But the reality is, yeah, you're, you're shipping these things with like weapons of destruction and they're killing right. each other. But don't let them. Yeah. You know, so uh, my dad smokes cigars and uh, uh, pipe tobacco. And he's like a very like a, a tobacco and pipe connoisseur. connoisseur. So, uh, yeah, it's I've just kind of grown up around cigars. He Don't prefers... you just want to go like this to this guy, though? I know, <laughs> right? Look at that beautiful texture. And that's another thing is, like, it's been so cool to see Arlen and Dan, like, just, like, really dial up all these yeah, textures man. for this this iteration of the, the figures. Yeah, that really looks great. I'm going to pitch another exclusive. I, that's all I do whenever I see you guys live <laughs> on the stream. I, I'll pitch an exclusive. Um, I kind of want to see a Terror Dog exclusive version of um, Grime. What? Is that, like, from Ghostbusters, you mean? Yeah. That's exactly what okay. I thought when I saw this too. This right did here. Did y'all? I think that would be awesome. First of all, but did you guys see that? Like in the promo art or the concept art for the uh, for Afterlife, the the Terra Dog's pupils were actually a triangle. I thought that was such a cool touch. I don't know if it oh, actually really? made it into production, but I thought it was pretty sweet. Beautiful stuff. All right, moving on. The women. Finally, we're going to get some women in Animal Warriors of the Kingdom. They're coming in wave three. I'm not saying it, Jay Shot. I'm just moving as if that didn't happen. And just so keep going. There's Mother Mala, yeah, with alternate head. <laughs> Lady Jadu with alternate head. We've got the rogue weapon sets. We've got Jessa, and we've already seen her alternate head, but we haven't seen the other two. And we. <laughs> saw these and got them um shown uh in this form on the site and we unlocked this in day 22 but if i can take a moment just to take a look at these and i just i was blown away when i first saw this i was like what the hell is going on with that character jason um tell me more 
and well, he wouldn't everyone's gonna have to wait for the second story arc to see yeah man the second story arc just freaking hit it slaps holy cow i can't wait for you to read it and i mean you know bricks got to read issue five but most of the tribe hasn't got to read issue five and that's because we're really trying to concentrate on the uh, the physical media so you know after issue four comes out in the physical version then everyone will be able to finally find out what happened at the end of issue five or, or kind of wrap up the first story arc, so to speak. So this is that head in render form. And this was, has is not on the site. I don't think it's been shown in the updates. It was on a stream on Friday. Um, and that was the only place it's lived. And we're starting to get this out there and wanted to share this here tonight too. Damn. Sorry. This That's is my coffee good. table. Oh, take a moment. Sorry, for me, this oh, I was just so into um, what you showed here with, with this and Jadu, who we'll see in a second. But I love this helmet. I was getting, I was telling folks, I told Jason, this gives me um, Fist of the North Star vibes. I'm old. Thanks, so <laughs> the 80s version. I only know one version. I yes, only know the 80s yeah, yeah. movie, the 85 version. And just blown away by this paint and then getting in there with those pupils and it's still a little sloppy for my taste. I, I like I was taking uh, whip photos, so it's cleaned up a little bit since then. But it gives you it gives you a good idea. Here's some of the work in progress stuff. You still in. got purple hair right there. That's yeah. for the purple gang. Yeah. <laughs> PGG. I love um, that mask too in the front of that mask. Is it is it gonna stay that kind of metallic? Oh, like definitely, yeah. Stuff. Yeah, I, yeah I it'll be it. metallic, yeah. yeah. And then there's Jadu, who you saw earlier in Renders, who looked great in Renders, but, uh, and there you go, sort of the side view, the back details. So what would you see the butterfly joints in there. That's a good that's way to right. kind of like that's show right. the butterflies in there. Yeah. Oh, she has butterflies? Oh, they all Every, do They now. all have butterflies. Nice. Now, uh, you know, the elephant and the rhinos most likely aren't going to have that. But maybe we'll try. And then you've got the yeah. Um, oh, I what, what tripped me out when I saw this was like, wait, what's going on? Was she a robot this whole time? But right. no, 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 Jason she's did reveal that. Yeah, she's definitely wearing a helmet. Yeah, it's like, like a Star Lord type. Yeah, the, type they'll get the more access kind of to. Yeah, we we kind of sneak peeked little little bits and pieces of of tech in the first one just to kind of um, set up the the expectation or so that people aren't shocked i feel like we kind of took the uh game of thrones approach where like the first season you don't really see any kind of dragons or magical type stuff and that's a lot of what we tried to do with season one or, or the first story arc of the comic and i refer to it as season one because you know we eventually want to do a cartoon so uh if you hear me say season one or episode one i'm talking about the first story arc of the comic and uh issues Yep, I'm yep. actually going to put this head on a Baroness. I want, you know. Oh, yeah. That's a good doll. <laughs> and then the paints, man. When I saw this, when this graced my inbox, I was like, what What am I looking at? At first, I was like, anyway, it's it's awesome here. Let me zoom in a little bit. Yeah. And how? I did repaint her eyes pink. Oh. So her eyes are the same pink yeah. as her hair now. Okay. I just thought it needed to pop a little bit more than the blue. Yeah. I just think the it tech, good though here, but yeah, the pink. I think the pink matching the hair will be a good call. So yeah, I love the the tech contrasting with the furry arms and that cool torso. Look at her wild abs, and yeah, for sure that butterfly man. I need that butterfly to do like that, you know, dramatic like arms back kind of thing. Yeah. Oh, let's save that for later. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I know you got a few more. You got a few more things you want to go through, D Blake. I think we're gonna. I think uh, D Blake has a question about epic Olins, but D Blake, I'm gonna save your question. Yeah, let's so we save get that. through everything because I think I there's gonna be more that we want to kind of show yep. off. So I've got you started. You have not been forgotten. There's a lot of yes. new people checking in that we want to just say hi to. Seven Nine Six Studios is uh, is is all over these these hey. you know, figures. So um, there's uh, there's a lot going. There's a lot going on in the chat. They are uh, they are popping. And Marvel fan, we will touch on x-men but we will not do spoilers we've already touched on it a little bit um but uh you know let's uh we, we certainly will not do 
any spoilers as uh, as it is it's less than 24 hours old. So, um, all right, Brick, continue. Will do. Um, so we were there. Where I can just sit back and relax. This is a great. <laughs> well, just a D Blake. So so far, everything has been unlocked at this point. So if you're everything before this, if you want to go to the Kickstarter, you can kind of look at that. We saw Kanji. We saw Boon before. We saw the weapon sets, which are wild. Definitely check those out. This guy was unlocked as well at day 26. Um, and so we, I don't believe this is up here. Maybe it is. Um, and this shows off the alt heads. And so far, the Horrid Assassin, not yet ready for prime time. But those will be shared as soon as possible. And this was unlocked as well. And so at this point, I believe this is the furthest we're at. Because I think we're at 238 or it's gone up. So you we're can kind of go back. We're at 239, 422. Holy, so just, okay. Just okay. shy of 240. Okay, which would unlock the next thing. So that's awesome. All the toy daddies um, have to do an epic all in right now. Yeah. I, I thought the next unlock was 260. <laughs> Oh, is yeah, it? Well, man. let's see. Maybe, you might be right. You might be right. You might be right. Yeah. Oh, hey, let's take I a look at some. Head. This has not been seen anywhere yet, hey. uh, but this is. So it's not even on that that image that we just showed you. It's not on the site yet. Just the um, concept art is. But um, so in my opinion, go. this kind of makes Kanji a Kanji an army builder because like they have two different heads now. You know, he's gonna have the same eyes and same color, but it's like. Now, if you kind of want to have like a little squad of three of these guys, you can alternate the heads. And they can all have different ears kind of right. um, positions because they all, all these ears, these ears do move. You can see the ball joint right here. Right here. Yeah, exactly. And, and that'll go a long way to like make them feel very expressive. And I said this last time that uh, our last stream that um, what we need to do is like, work with some customizers and this sort of community, right? I love how like I can get all sorts of cool third party designed and printed totally, yeah. stuff for yeah. legions. Like I want that for this and like where yeah. we can like yeah. pop out those ears, give us new ears. Go, right. Go you could do like the uh, Osagi, Osagi Jimbo, like where mm -hmm. it's like, you know, tied back. His ears are kind of tied in a bun. Yeah. I always how? think of two or like the old flight helmets. Right, the yeah. old, like, leather light helmets mm -hmm. to fit over with the glass, the goggles. Oh, that Ooh. sounds cool too. Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah. Right? How yeah, easy is it? Off, how easy is it to pop off those ears so you could put it'll be on it'll be it. relatively easy. You're gonna need to heat the head up, but uh, yeah, you know, just just the nature of the way those two different it's gonna be two different plastics. One's gonna be hard. Mm -hmm. One's gonna be soft. Mm -hmm. uh, so the ears will be the softer plastic. So just heat them up. Should be able to pop them right out. He said, yeah, so that, uh, that helmet uh, idea that J J Shot was talking about, yeah, could work really well, yeah. And uh, uh you, as you do pop out the ears, if you call up Jason, he will make that noise for you each time. That is guaranteed, <laughs> uh, yeah. You have to let me know, <laughs> you just gotta give him a warning. So, yeah, there you go. So, this is where you can kind of see the process. This was the, the 2D art, and then you just saw the 3D art. Um, and then this sort of shows, yeah, this was an early, early thing just to sort of show the ears. Yeah, I'm picturing like one ear that might be like hanging over or mm -hmm. like you get that some sort of floppy cool. ear. Yeah, those floppy ear bunnies, right? right. Those rabbits. Mm -hmm. yep. Then the alt head for Boone. Um, this is when he's like the, just going like just. This like, looks great. The Boone head is great. Yeah. Thank you. And yeah, this is um, this is stuff that's not on the updates yet. So happy oh, to yeah. share that here. Look at that. This little white tough stuff coming out of his ears. I love He's that. So cute. Um, little angry furry guy. <laughs> I love it. Uh, okay, so back to uh, we're almost believe it. Yeah, see, this is the thing. It's like it 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 is kind of a haul to get through this Kickstarter. We and talk about a it ton because of stuff, guys. Well, you didn't just unlock a ton of stuff. You like offered a ton of stuff. Right. It's crazy from the beginning. We, yeah, we we started off wanting to do head packs like we did with wave one and two. And then yeah. we were like, you know what? Just put them in the figure. That way people don't have to hunt stuff down. They automatically yeah. just have it in the box. Yep. You know? This is the exclusive. Don't need to talk too much about them if, if you've checked it out before, but just you know, you can read about it. It's it's a uh essentially using the same body as the first one but in 
translucent and glow in the dark and pale is rad and we know this and not at all trying to shortchange him but this again from the beginning was where the kickstarter sort of ended and you guys this are right was what was it what did you say right? 240 oh yeah sorry 260 you're right we got a ways yeah. to go i'm sorry yeah. i was tripping yeah that's so okay hurry up Let's go twenty thousand okay. dollars. Come on, I folks. Mean, I mean, come on. We can. I mean, like we're just we're under five, just about five seventy eight here to hit two forty. I feel like I feel like we should be able to well, get that well, before the stream oh, ends. Yeah, yeah. So, it's been doing this lately, and so it's it's definitely. Yeah. I think Jason's heart is about to fail. So, exactly. um, good thing I've what, got three of them. <laughs> like, there we go. Now we've got the reveal. <laughs> this is Jason. new. Jason this has is not been a lion and a lifetime ban at the zoo. So, all right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm an alien, this, baby. This is brand new. This hasn't oh, been seen anywhere. Oh, yeah. This is not, so it's not on the site this. yet. At so cool. this is what we'll get unlocked. Yeah. So, we've seen the render. I'm sorry, the, the illustration. And this is now the render. Definitely, you know, it's a, a there's, there's just some differences, good. right? When he's, they kind of do uh, it. missing and, his wings. And he's missing yeah. his wings. You want to explain the wings, how that's going to work for folks right. who were wondering? So if anyone's got uh, the comic book version of Falcon or the uh, the Crow villain army builders from Power Rangers where the, ar where the uh, okay. wings kind of plug into the back part of the arms mm -hmm. and the bicep, that's the, that's the idea for the wings. So if mm -hmm. for some reason you want to have them displayed without his wings, you can do that uh, or have it on there. And uh, I think I don't know if I might have said been last time when we were on both of your shows or when someone was on both of your shows, but it, they, they will have gripping feet, right? So alternate He's got the feet gripping as feet. well, exactly. Yeah, awesome. And then the uh, weapon storage. So these were what were shown before, Jason. These are those same. That's them. Yep. So they'll be be able to take pull them out, put them back in. Uh, I don't think they're going to be removable, but okay. Okay. Uh, so. So, uh, oh my God, it's all going down now. Uh, so, so the hand, we're going to have a special hand for him where he's like throwing, uh, kind of, ah. I wish I had my, uh, I wish I had my Havoc, uh, gotcha. not Havoc, who is it? But it'll be Long the, guy, like this. The, the Cajun guy that throws the cards that are on oh, fire. Gambit. Gambit. Yeah, Gambit. Like it's going to be Remember, very similar to that. Dan actually sculpted that Sorry. figure. Mm -hmm. Dan sculpted that figure. So if you've got that gambit, it'll be very similar to that. Like the three throwing knives. <laughs> oh man, we lost D Blake's. We lost him. D Blake. That's it. That's it. He's like, Dan's damn it, those things better come out. Yeah. Um, oh. No. And then Sorry, this this right here is what's behind him. Yeah. So there is some weapon storage there. Yes, there's gonna be a weapon storage. That's another thing we're working on. Um we're gonna be doing a lot of weapon storage that like if, if you have any of the uh, current figures, they'll have holes in their back. So we'll have like special storage that's going to plug into their back and hold on to the weapons. I love that. Cool. That's cool. I like right. that you guys thought about that too, right? Like it's not, again, I think we talked about this a little bit on the last stream where it's like, you know, you, you, you got these things and just the way that you're getting them set up, it's like, how would they carry this? And it's just like thinking it through and thinking it, building these pieces from a story perspective again, not just right. A, this would be cool to make. It's, you know, why is he carrying, you know, why do you have weapon stores? He would have, you know, like that's how he would travel. So I appreciate that tremendously. Me too. I'm going to move through. I know, man, people are like, damn, you guys have been streaming so much. We know this already. Move on. So birds, <laughs> birds are cool. We need birds. 290,000. Let's go. Oh, you love the birds. Yeah, yeah, we need our wonder we know shop we're target be birds. The last and we 48 need hours. So yeah. all this stuff's going to get unlocked. But it's cool to skating. check it out. Skating. I really, I really like monster. these. I need to add this guy's weapons. This is a this. Sorry, this guy. Bruce yeah, Alex. this guy. We need to add his weapons. I have them uh, sitting on my computer. I just need to color them. Uh, but this will be using the brawler buck. So this will be the fourth uh, use of that buck. Yeah, people are asking like, where's the renders for this stuff? And so they are coming, but also it's like, you know, there's all sorts of things to generate. Um, I, I will tell folks that like, I f if the team gets the, feels the pressure to get the renders out when when we get closer yeah. to those unlocks. So yeah. hint, hint, wink, wink, pressure them. Another pressure thing them. that's really cool is, you know, in the last Kickstarter, uh, we unlocked everything that we planned on unlocking. Um, 
except for Thane. So we had like physical versions of everything, like right out the bat. Uh, except for Thane, there was a digital version. After the Kickstarter, we're going to be doing showing all these like digital renders and like paint masters and stuff. So there's going to be a lot of reasons to keep checking in on the Kickstarter uh, via yeah. updates. We'll obviously post it on our Instagram and Facebook. And uh, yeah, it, it, as many places that'll like have us to talk about it. We'll be updating that stuff whenever we have like a new a new uh, progress shot to show you guys. Brutox and the Botox, 380,000. That's a big jump from there to there. We got to keep mm -hmm. going. We got to move. So, um, but yes, we got to get Brutox for sure because he's cool. He is built on that um, uh, brawler buck. Um, and then we've heard this name a lot. Mamba, Mamba, Mamba. Um, so again, if people were Hello, wanting him, $89 ultra figure. So if you're like, you want to help push that thing forward and get towards him now, go ahead and back for $89. Just type that in and it'll get there. And then you can convert it to Mamba when he gets unlocked. But if yep. you wait, that's $89 less that we have to move towards mm -hmm. this goal. Right. And you're not, you're not getting billed for that right now. So yes, uh, we, we right. mentioned before, you know, do the $89 with no reward. And then as soon as it unlocks, uh, you'll be able to just switch it over to Mamba. And if for some reason he unlocks in like the last couple of seconds and you're like having trouble switching over, don't panic. You'll have access to it as soon as the backer kit goes live. So it's essentially yeah. just like you're just placing down your, uh, your voucher so that whenever yeah. he gets unlocked, you you have it and you're not gonna have to worry about paying the actual retail price when it goes when it rolls over to the standard pre-order. Right. Now, and just I don't as want a, oh, I was gonna say just as a reminder, you got six six more days, right? Six more days to yes. back. So correct. If you yeah. get some Mamba, we've got to make a decision. You gotta get there. We gotta you gotta really gotta really gotta push now. Um and we yeah. know there's always that push towards the end, but uh you know Jason did mention this last time too. You got you got a couple paychecks periods that this will happen over in the next couple of days, hopefully, or you know and if you were good and you filed your taxes, you might have your tax return by the time this hits. So, you know, don't don't be shy on that epic all in. And <coughs> I hope you got a you return. Know, don't be shy. You know, you'll. Toy father uh, backed his, didn't he? he now did? it's no chewing in Yimbo. Oh, sorry, sorry, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. My, my mistake, toy father. Uh, no chewing, Yimbo. What are we slacking on? You got a tax return coming. Let's go. <laughs> is that an old school that. printer? What is that? Come is on, that a fax? Come I don't know. On, I don't know if it's too Mikey. That's all, you know what it is? That's all the numbers coming in for the orders for you guys. It's just coming in on a, a fax machine. <laughs> I'll allow it. Writer. Somebody's got it. That's what it is. It's, it's that tear away with the things on the side. I got a, you know, it's a dot matrix printer. It's, uh, you know, it's, it's every Yeah, then you put them together same. and you make those little That's pretty awesome. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. That's all free in the packing, too. That's what we packed them in. So there you go. Uh, Hello, uh, fellow old people. Um, yeah, so. so we were that. here. This was the end for the longest time and the last time when we spoke with you all. Um, but um, over the weekend, I believe, maybe Sunday. Yeah, Sunday we revealed and we just said, okay, just you know, Mamba isn't actually the end. We lied. We're not sleeping at all. We're going to um, unlock Zwar, the Pachydine officer, yes. uh, who you sort of saw in the beginning of the stream and you saw his tattoos here. Um, and... And if you're, this has become a thing, uh, fully naked underneath there. In other words, no little like tidy whiteies or anything. It's going to be matching his legs because, because yeah. series not? one They're and two did have briefs. Yeah. But, mm -hmm. but when you say fully naked, we're, we're kenning it, right? We're not like, we're kenning. He won't it. be anatomically yeah, correct. Okay. All right. Cool. Okay. We're so there's no it. extra plastic. Just, the right, no rep, extra plastic. The we'll reptiles be definitely are. Kin. Yeah, the reptiles are anatomically correct per reptile by uh, anatomy. Yeah, um, reptile anatomy. Thank you. yeah right, you these that. guys, something <laughs> something happened in the process of, yes, anyways. It's okay, it's um, okay. Uh, so just real quick, Red X. Red X so, it's part of the lore, whatever. <laughs> says, Jason, uh -huh. breathing is gorgeous. Will the alternate head be Thank you. a different bird type? Question on that. Mm. Uh, so... He, the alternate head for raving is actually uh, him with his hat. Uh, so oh, yes, we talked I don't about think yeah, he actually doesn't show up till episode till issue five. So uh, he's actually not even show, he's not even like portrayed in the comic in issue five with his hat off. So uh, he will come with that alternate head and it's got that it's got his hat on. It's it's very distinctive to his character. 
Uh, but that being said, the real thing that's important is uh, getting that bird body unlocked because we're going to make a ton of birds with that. So uh, don't worry about it if that particular bird head doesn't like fit what you're looking for. We're going to be doing all of the birds. All right. And, uh, and very on brand for him, Thanos Copter is very disappointed that they're not going to be on Copter. <laughs> so, I feel uh, it. I mean, I, feel I, feel it I, sure. I know for a fact he's got like a drawer filled with parts that he can customize and make, it's make even, it work. It's weirder that it's a drawer full of one twelve parts. <laughs> it's, you know, like, but hey. We love them anyway. All right, continue, continue, break. Uh, I think we're pre approaching the end. So this is Vitus, another Pachydine infantry member. But uh, my favorite part is, folks will know, it doesn't say articulated jaw. It says articulated mouth. Um, because, I, you know, I don't know if you're familiar with, like, with the way hippos move. I just, I wasn't sure. You And maybe you can answer this, Jason. Are we talking this part going down? Or are we talking this part going up? It's going to be the it's going to be the, the bottom jaw that's going to open up. Okay. So it'll be the jaw. Okay. Sorry, I had yeah. um, hungry, hungry hippo fantasies oh, in my brain. Oh, I, I immediately went to the hippopotamus <laughs> song. That, uh, Hippopanopolis? Yeah. Yeah, that it's happened last time. <laughs> yeah. um, so I think I want to say, yeah, that 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 takes us to the Kickstarter. So this is really the new goalpost. Uh, it wasn't 410. Right. Mamba's great, but I want Vitus. Uh, I want my all in to, to be ridiculously heavy and epic and just uh this wasn't mentioned and uh but it was 640 sorry 650 for the epic all in um but then it charges you 40 at least to me here in california the, the what it's coming up as i don't know what's different per area um as 40 dollars for shipping and so you heard jason for say everyone that, in the u.s across the okay board. Across the board, and that's going to be shipped in multiple waves. So, right to be clear, to do the math, and you're like forty dollars for what three or four potentially three or four different right. shipments. Yep. I'm sorry, sorry Jason. Hey, congratulations. Too late. You said it already. No, we're totally fine. We no. talked about it before we mentioned it. We're we're all good. It's all good. Yep. And will and all it. the boxes say congratulations yeah. on? Yeah, I don't have any items. Honest. You're another winner. Yeah. You won the yeah. lottery. Again. You won stuff. We just want to give you this. Yeah. 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 Me. Epic, me. epic prize. Yeah. One of four. Your additional yeah. prizes will be coming in the future. Congratulations. Somebody's there's gonna be some some sad guy who's just like <laughs> on vacation when it arrives and they <laughs> oh, and their wife just sees it. Right? And gives it all away. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> uh, Money is almost trying to scam us. All right. Yeah. Um, all right. So let's. So now that you've gone through everything, let's jump back to Z Blake's question. Can we review just how much is actually in the Epic only at this point? Number of figures and extra. So this is where the math is going to come in. So let's uh, let's lay it out, Brick. What do we? Uh, how many calculator. Okay. Are Blake, actually, you got your ca calculator ready or? <laughs> calculator. Okay. Calculator. All right. Calculator? So actually, I kind of have this, but let's see. Um, well, so I'm not going to add up the um, existing figures, or I, I guess we could just do it. Here we go. Everything, let's everything go. that you're going to get, yeah. Let's go, crazy people. All right, let's one. Welcome to the math stream. Okay, so thirty-three dollars <laughs> for uh, Corvius, thirty-three dollars for Gresh. Uh, what is it? Fourteen for weapons, Jason. It's uh, nineteen ninety-nine for weapons. Sorry, no, I'm that's. I'm sorry. Multitasking here. Hold on a second. Hold on. There's an easier way to do this. And you're you're doing 19.99. Okay. Here. I'm. I think I can share this. Oh you're yeah. Not... I don't. I don't know what the Kickstarter price for it is. I'm sorry. Oh uh, well, we do have it. And you're. Are you good with showing that that uh, spreadsheet I put together? Yeah, I want them to see the savings. You know. Okay. Cool. 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 Let me just. I'm trying to see. Is there anything in here that you can't see? Um. All right. Take that away. Yeah. What's that? Put the credit card number away. Yeah, yeah, no. Um, I'll put Mario's credit card away. Let's uh, see. Okay. Welcome, uh, Kevin. If I, if I move What's this, up, does Kevin? that work? Still recovering okay. from the weekend. <laughs> so here we go. Let's do this. And can I zoom in? Yes, I can. All right. Okay. So this you're is bring, the price of that back? Corvus. Back oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. My bad. I want to make sure. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Okay. So 
Um, Corvus 33 estimated retail at 37.99 and so on. The the, the cold blooded weapon set 14. Don't worry, I'll show you the math in a second. Mm -hmm. And uh, 20.99 for retail and so on. Right. So you see, we have unlocked this. This is in play. That's in play. This is in play. And you can just kind of see the numbers yeah. again. I'll do the math at the end. I'm not expecting anyone to do the mental math now. But if you are, congratulations to you and your life choices. Unlock Jessa, all that's unlocked, all that's unlocked, and so on. So I believe at this point, come on. Oh, I do this in class all the time. Come on. Mm -hmm. There's got to be a way to zoom out. There you go. Apple, you disappoint me sometimes. All right. <clears throat> so the from here all the way down to what have we, was the last thing we unlocked? Uh, Horrid. And including uh, spectral pale. Spectral pale. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So all of that. And then you can see the total right here. That's 528 mm -hmm. so far. I'm skipping these guys because they're not unlocked. So sad. This is what we need to do, folks. We need oh, that's it. Yeah. There. There. So right now, everything that's unlocked, that works out to be $528 in Kickstarter prices Kickstarter. i need yep. to emphasize that right? right so if you take uh the epic all in you I hear you folks at the right now the epic all in you're like man that that hasn't quite hit the value yet because the epic all in is 650 we're a little bit away from that so if we can unlock raving and merrill and scathing the weapon set and brute talks that kind of i think it's after the weapon set is where it'll start kicking in that value you can yep. see here 686 yep so that's what we're talking about yep. and then of course you've got and this hasn't been shown before but now you see the retail prices and every yep. just note that everything here is estimated estimated at yep. this point and uh i think that's it is yep. yeah the yeah yeah, yeah. so 919 total here is what we're looking at for Kickstarter prices. So just, now, just scroll back, scroll back up. I was gonna say let's let's actually count um in terms of value in figures, mm -hmm. right? Like not not number value, not not uh price Dollar value, value. like okay. No, no, no. I'm just saying, like, so as of right now, if you're doing an epic all in, you're currently getting how many figures and how many weapon sets at this point as to what's unlocked. And like you know, yep. So you got spectral pale. So, so from here spread. all the way to spectral pale, that gets you 17. Yeah. That's including 17. the a couple of what uh four weapon sets, I want to say. Four yeah. Sets. So four weapon sets, so that's 13 figures all in mm -hmm. right now. I feel like that almost putting it that way makes it feel right price-wise aside, because I think the, the big the big thing here is you got the, the Kickstarter price versus the retail price. So if you were to yep. go buy 13 figures and four weapon sets. Yep. In retail, you know, your the savings is really that's where you're seeing the savings. But I mean, sure. the fact that for six hundred bucks you're getting thirteen figures, right? And again, shipping separately so that you don't have to hide all thirteen from your wife at the beginning. So <laughs> like that's it's a pretty good right. deal. That's, I mean, like right now, right now as is, it's a great deal, right? I mean, especially if you're thinking about it from the retail price, because if you're not in on the Kickstarter, you're not getting it at the Kickstarter price. So you're yep. looking at it that way, but. 13 figures, four weapon sets. I don't know. I'm getting nervous just about how much room I'm going to make for, for when these things start. <laughs> that's, that's my Yeah, concern. I think when, whenever all this is said and done, you're definitely going to have to have like two shelves for your AWOL collection. Yeah. Yeah, You at least at least two shelves. Um, then a copter, copter says uh, you can add that's a, builders for yeah. the leftover value. Right? Yeah, Absolutely. exactly. Yeah. Right. That That's what I wanted. I was waiting to say that, you know, if for some reason we don't unlock those characters, You'll, you'll still get the voucher where you can just add in the additional. You're like, oh, well, I guess I'll add additional lizard or I'll add Thank additional grain grimes or something like that or additional female figure. So, yep, yeah, you're right. still you're still going to get slots in. It's just, you know, and we're, we're talking yeah. like a theoretical right now. I mean, we know we're going to rally in the last 48 hours. So, right. I, I mean, I'm not right. sweating it. I'm just kind of like hanging yeah. out and and just, you know watching all the all the uh updates be i'm sorry watching all the reveals as we like go right. into that last 48 hours and i do think i think mario has the quote of the night uh also if you do the epic all in you can avoid all that math you don't have to worry exactly about yeah totally right thank you, you don't like math if you don't like math just go epic all in 
Yeah. And, I, I uh, and D. you heard it here. D Blake trying to show off. He says he's got a whole shelf ready for them. Don't be fooled, though. D Blake bought a brand new house just so that he could have room. Oh, my yeah. all his stuff. So don't be showing off with all your fancy shelves here, D Blake. We know. We know. We know what you really did. I, I'm going to so, be honest. When Brick Something pulled out the, the Excel, I started playing with the figure in my hand. I was like, I'm <laughs> epic all in. I don't got to think about yeah. this. Yeah, I don't think about it. Anyway. Yeah, you know, I gotta go. And and to to be fair, it's a uh, Google Sheets. You know, Microsoft okay. don't need that extra advertising. Sorry. But yeah, Google no, Sheets. I'm just kidding. Because <laughs> Google does anyway. Um, yeah. <laughs> the uh, and so this is what we're talking about here. We we know that there is. You see that faint pink line was the last Kickstarter, and so we did add extra days more than that. So I, I'd last say we're thirty like days maybe about here. Yep. <laughs> And so we yeah. hopefully we see the same thing. And this is just reminding we me of will. work I'm that I should do. It. Additional work I should things. do, Jason. You we got to hit up the, the other. Oh, I was just going to say we need to hit up all the other gonna, folks who backed last help? time. No, no, no. Just that we got to hit up all the folks who, yeah, absolutely. who backed last time. Because uh, they're out there somewhere. Definitely. And we need to make sure they're, they're looking they're at there. this next one. We can see on the back end how many people are like following the campaign, and it tracks very similar to yep. the last time. So it's a it's a little bit more. So, so thank you for uh, attending the AWOC TED Talk. I appreciate the patience. I know that's a <laughs> lot to sit and listen to. So, but at the end of the day, we just we hope we want to get the info out there and you know show people the fun stuff that that could potentially be on your shelf. Yeah. No, look, this is great. I mean, I'm just getting getting to see the new reveals was awesome. Um, you know, uh, and getting to see the new reveals was awesome. Getting to see how far we've come along. And again, talking to you guys again, the passion comes through. That's what we love. The passion comes through. The figures are great. Um, you know, we're still, still I, you know, I know that you said in the other stream that you were sending figures to to people to feel and play with. I mean, Machu, I mean, I haven't been home, but Machu drives by my thing. I don't know if anything's shown up yet, but we'll, we'll check. We'll check. But, uh, D Blake says, uh, like says <laughs> just so you know, I didn't get nothing either. <clears throat> yes, it does. So, uh, you know, you can you can always treat your shelf. There you go. With a walk sign. Once you build your shelf, you can. It treat looks your great shelf, with the so. display. Yeah, uh, there you go. Uh, and yes, Yimbo did get a haircut. Good job, D Blake, on noticing that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> love that. So, um, but cool, man. Uh, guys, I appreciate you jumping on. You know, thank I think you. in the beginning, you guys were like, we're just going to do a quick 10 minutes. Oh, thanks for it's having an hour us. And a, it's an hour and 20 minutes have now gone by. Uh, we're all a bit smarter wow. um, and scared by math. But uh, again, I think I think what we let's look at. If you guys take one thing away from tonight, it is if you do the epic all in, you do not have to do math. That is the biggest thing that I think we should learn. Be like, I'm you know, so be old. Like father, be like Machu, be like myself. Don't be. I know chewing or yimbo. Do yourself a favor. <laughs> do the epic one. <laughs> Avoid them. all of the wow. other existing <laughs> spiral <laughs> figures. I don't want to hear it. Okay. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. I'm still yeah. contemplating. Jeez. <laughs> no shame. No shame. <laughs> hey man, thank you. Seriously, thank you yeah, to all of, of you because I know we we've kind of gone through different mm -hmm. streams and thanks for making time for us again. Yeah, sorry. You're saying you weren't expecting us to be here that long. I'm sorry we took so much of the show. No. So oh, no. thank you. Guys. No, don't apologize. Dude, 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 I mean, apologize. we had nothing planned for tonight. Big takeaway. Yeah, I was going to oh. have you guys back on is awesome. So, uh, again, yeah, here we go. Oh, no, I was just going to say big takeaway is that there's a lot of details about these figures that don't translate necessarily yeah. within the photos. Like for myself, I didn't realize that the female figures have butterfly it's joints true. because on the front, you know, just by seeing it that way, right. it doesn't look like it's there. So, that's good information to have. Yeah. Yes, I mean, and again, uh, please. Please, Brick, I, I'm just teasing. Like, we, we're more than happy. Oh, no, I know. Go I mean, I'm, no, I'm with so, you, Brick. I'm offended. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. Heaven forbid. My you you can talk to Machu. It's part of uh, it's know. part of our culture, the, the shame and the guilt. So, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Please, I'm Catholic. I know. It's okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Thanks, Jimbo. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so yeah, much. Go, Seriously, go appreciate enjoy. it. I know that you got you got uh, you got. Thank you for having us. Too. Yeah, you're going on Adam's stream later tonight, right? Anytime. <laughs> you got another stream tonight? Uh, no, no. I I'm actually don't. I'm, I'm hanging out with my kiddo, but there is tonight on highly articulated. He is opening wave three figures and will definitely answer mm. all of the questions. So all the folks awesome. here definitely go direct those there. I see a bunch of stuff that mythic dolphins there and some other folks that weren't addressed. 
definitely um, Adam will be on in a little bit. You can hit him up. And then I think that's it for tonight. Yeah. Jason's recording something with other folks. So it, the, right. it continues, but we're doing it. Thanks. Jason Brick, thank you again. Guys, we'll, we'll see you next time. And no sleep till mama. We are spreading the love. Night, y'all. Have fun. Bye. Bye. No Bye. sleep till mama. Bye. Thank y'all so much. Bye, Jason. Thank, thank you, Jason. Jason. Uh, and Messi, I just saw your question come in. I know that those guys had a jump, but uh, as mentioned, Adam is doing a stream tonight. I think hit him up, hit him up on that stream, um, and share the love a little bit. And I'm sure, I'm sure they're they're open to anything here, right? Like, let's you know, yeah. let's be real. They'll, they'll make prehistoric reveals. Let's do it. So, uh, hey, toy daddies, don't you? Uh, Hi. Don't you guys have a, don't you have a hey show? Guys. To do? <laughs> well, <laughs> well, you stay here, and we're just doing it. Are we doing it now? Is this what's happening? Chris, did you cancel the other stream? Yeah, you told okay, me perfect. to. Perfect. I, I didn't check though. <laughs> oh, okay. I thought you were telling me to like redo it. <laughs> you just rolling into the next one. Is that it? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Oh yeah. All right. Cool. What what are we talking about? So, <laughs> so, anybody have any uh pick up anything cool over the weekend? Uh I did. I I had a pick up while I was uh while I was away. I was, you know. Hitting up, hitting up the old targets. I got the uh, the five hundred first and Ahsoka two pack. Oh, uh, nice! So I was pretty pretty That's excited cool. to find those. Nice. And in store find of Tombstone, who he's pretty dope, man. He he moves really well. I'm pretty happy he's with good. him. He's a good figure. So, and uh, I know that you know we always go back and forth as to why do I need another set of five hundred first clones? But these new clone bodies are awesome. They move right. really, really. Oh, well. are they improvement from? Uh, uh, I mean, I think they are. They feel like they are. So, the set uh, I have are they always felt gummy. No, I don't think this feels gummy at all. Is that the set that you have? Is it with the, with the pins? Are they pinless? Sure. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, they have. It was the one. They were on retro cards. I think they had pins though. Yeah. The, yeah. Those are the gummy ones. Yeah. yeah those move. Pins. Those move better. Yeah. So, um, I only picked up, and they have the what's called heads too, the clone heads, which the painted oh, clone heads, the painted ones. If you, if, yeah, because you can pop the helmets off the other ones, and they have clone heads that are unpainted, which doesn't make any sense. But you know, so. well, they were the they had the head sculpt in in the helmet, but you had to like really heat it up to pull off the helmet. Yeah, strange, yeah. but yeah, that's uh, that's my pickup. So far this week, Yimbo, I know you had toys popping up. Oh, you got? I got my Bob yeah. Ross yesterday. Look at that. Hell yeah. <laughs> nice. I've always debated getting that. That's the one from NECA. Yeah. Yeah. It's so silly, but I love them so Should much. We collab? Oh. Oh, my God. You got him too? Yeah. I, I, I've had him for a long time. Oh, but my yeah. man. Yeah, he just, he just stays right next to my desk and gives me yeah. thoughts every time and, I look at him. And this thing is awesome. That thing's awesome. Now yeah. it's like here it is compared to like a one six, so it is tiny. But yeah. with some photography, it, like the actual frame itself isn't that large. No. Can, so, can I just say, Yimbo, that's yes, you, you shared of us, and I I don't know if you want to blow up your spot, but. That was an incredible video of you as Bob Ross. Oh, it's on my story today. Okay. <laughs> my God. That was like the best thing that made my day. That was, uh, I really like Halloween. I don't know if you guys know that. And um, <laughs> there was a stretch. I mean, like every year with whatever costume, I would try to do something goofy while, like during my lunch break. And I was Bob Ross that year. And yeah, happy little accidents. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, so that was great, and now uh, I'm opening up. Ooh. Nice, Ooh. awesome, cool. and I finally cracked open Ken just now, Ooh. and I'm halfway through snipping M Bison. Ooh, I like the M Bison a lot. Oh, I opened him up. Yeah, okay. this this cape is like ridiculous. Yeah, mm -hmm. now Yimbo, you have Chun Li, right? What am I, a psychopath? Of course, I have <laughs> Chun Li. <laughs> I know, seriously. <laughs> so of who course doesn't I have do. Chun-Li yet? Hmm? She's back there somewhere. Yeah, she's <laughs> right there. If you're, 
right, 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 right in the right background. Here. Here we are. She's um, it's she's hanging right. with the turtles. It's okay. I, I, you know, it's I, do have to, I do have to say, last week or was it last week when you guys said like I said that I passed on her at Target. Yeah, and you called me like even more of a psychopath. Yeah, but then I went to Target and I saw it on the shelf and I was like. This is a sign. I need to pick it up. So I, I put it there so that way you would pick it up. <laughs> like, thank you, Machu. You're welcome. <laughs> On my way back from Canada. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. I still hey, well, can't. Quick, quick jump out of the plane, did that, and moved yeah. back home. So. I still can't believe you found one in Target on the East Coast. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> like I any was, of these Street Fighter I mean, figures. Yeah, I was like, oh, I have to, I guess. Chun Li is the only one that I've seen in my Target. Oh well, I take that back. I I saw Fei Long also. But yeah, like saw Fei Long. So. Chun Li is the uh, only one that I bought. Man, Beast Boy, hoping Florida has Jada's. Uh, Man, Beast Boy, uh, DM me where where in Florida are you? Uh, I might be there too. I might be. So, um, all right. So, what else? Anybody else need pickups? Yeah, so, um, Twin Brother, you don't have to raise your hand. This is a joint stream. You can just. I did. That's yeah, okay. So, right here. Uh, yeah, this weekend I went to a comic book store in Massachusetts called Comically Speaking. They had an amazing 50% off sale. Uh, it was packed. And I went on the last day, which was Sunday, but I picked up the Sentinel Rockman, which is awesome. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. I have he that. Is, yeah. yeah. He is so, so awesome. Good. Um, and again, that was like uh, 40 bucks, something like that. Um, then I picked up because we've been watching X Men. I'm like, do I have a forge? And I don't have a forge. And they had all these forges. So this was like 10 bucks, something like that. All right, nice. Then I picked up this amazing DC. I missed DC icons um, line and picked up this guy. John Stewart, he's 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 awesome. He comes with these really amazing constructs. Um, this one being the best one, I think. A little flare. Yeah, a little flare. Uh, that was cool. Uh, what else? I did went to Target, picked up that. Only I went. I was. I uh, guys, this is the second weekend where I'm a little unhinged. Um, picked up this guy. Nice. Oh, cool. uh, you had come on. That was, was had so to good. had yeah. to again on the shelf by itself. Um, it was a sign. Then I picked this up for uh, Machu, but then realized uh, that he didn't. He already had one. So yeah, Machu didn't follow the uh, the spreadsheet. Give away, give away. <laughs> yeah, give away. away. Sounds good. Wait, 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 wait. Jay Shot, you don't want that, Leo? Uh, I already got it. <laughs> Toy Mer Toy Mer's got. I picked the, you went to Canada and I talked to Toy Mer. I think he picked everything up for me. He had he was holding one for me too. I think he's got extras. Oh. Well we double check before we give away a Toy Father's extra Leo. <laughs> Toy Father's like, wait, what? Toy <laughs> <laughs> I also I got have somebody else who has uh, who was holding another Leo in the chat. How many Leos? How many Leos are we holding? Oh yeah. <laughs> There's only one Leo in my target. There, I guess. The, um, and then I I got a diamond box this weekend, and um, I, I finally got this guy, and I'm so I excited. That. That's so cool. Excited. I love. Don't forget to paint those but, double dongs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why, Why paint them? Why wow. paint them? <laughs> Why paint? Or paint one. Just paint one. And you can have a JCBD Pishka deal. You know, <laughs> And in the mail today, I'm really excited. Chewie's been showing him off, but um, this guy. Uh, Mine is uh, stuck in Teterboro. It took Mine me a, sitting it, at my house. It took me a while to get these. Like, in whatever, like, Mine is in J Shot's house. <laughs> <laughs> I did pre order that Mikey, though. That, I, you you know, can't that's, survive. Not Mikey. I know. Yeah, I, I not did Mikey. too. Me too. I mean, the, the combo was expensive, like 55 bucks, something like that. Oh, really? this, I love this. By the way, everybody in the chat here, everybody's holding a Leo, right? Like even Mandy's voice, like I'm holding a Leo too. Actually, for Henry, everyone's holding Leos. Nobody's opening Leos, but everyone's holding them. I'm doing my so, part, ha and half <laughs> of them are holding them for me. <laughs> no one wants the Leo, huh? Okay. Yeah, no. <laughs> Narc. <laughs> um, but yeah, I have a lot of toys that I just oh these. 
these women came to. Nice. Cool. Oh, nice. nice. Very cool. I'm dying to talk about X Men. Yeah. Are we doing? Are we, are we, we, are we doing a thing? We can. We can tell. We can do it. We can. Yeah, we'll do, we'll do it this weekend. Yeah, because we have two episodes to go through. Two really good episodes. Okay, maybe we could talk a little bit towards the end Wait, of the show. We have two episodes. Did I miss it? Yeah, because Mojo Last World. Week, yeah, Mojo. Uh, Mo, oh, Mo, yeah. Mo, Mo, Motendo. Motendo. Okay. Oh, all right. Okay. Cool. Cool. I thought I missed one. So, oh, D Blake, you should really go watch it. In the end, no, I'm kidding. Uh, we wouldn't do that. Come on. Come on. We're better than that. No, no, no. Don't try. Uh, no. We're not talking about it now. <laughs> What six shooter just got here is Laser Monkey going to be an AWA? Trevor, why'd you get him started? He's really drunk. It's the whole chat now is going to be about this. <laughs> Speaking of Laser Monkey, guys, and, and get lazed. Monkey, Monkey King, I don't know. Um, uh, no. All right, what up? You get anything? Oh, I like this. Um, <laughs> I'm working on it. <laughs> um, I only got um, these ones in the mail. Mm -hmm. Nice. Do you like it? No, I love them. These are great. Did so. you guys immediately jump on uh, pre-ordering? Not a, not a, not a Mikey today. Y yes. yes. Oh yeah. All right, good, good. Yeah. Um, and, and that wrap. Toy Father has um, toys for me too. Yeah. Oh yeah, and I picked up a couple of things for uh, no chewing. Um, yeah. as I was like facetiming him in the store. Yeah, that was awesome. I didn't have to drive there. <laughs> Saved me forty-five minutes. He's like, hey, can you bring me to the uh to the what was it the Lego? Uh, carousel over there. I was like, oh my god. I was giving him directions. I was like, it's in the back left. It's in the spinner on the glass. I was just, like, okay, just turn to go. Harry Potter. Will you? Is there anything I, you want? Oh, I thought like the Lego carousel was like a thing, and he's like, all of a sudden now, I'm just picturing Toy Father standing outside the gate as as Chewie goes by on the Lego carousel. Wee, wee. Yeah, you know, Chris, John, Chris you, like, it's even better. Come on, you're not going again. We gotta go. We gotta go. Yeah. John, like John you mock, but you wish that was a thing. I, you and me holding hands, going around the Lego carousel. Did I? I mean, I wasn't invited, but I'd be on it with you. Come on, you I mean, I, you're invited now to our fictional playgrounds. Let's yeah. go. I love it. I love it. <laughs> was that much? You? I was gonna say, I love how all of us have. We're holding something for another person on stream. <laughs> That's true. Everyone, yeah, like, I mean, except Yimbo. Yimbo's only keeping stuff for himself. No, well, <laughs> I guess I, I guess I don't. <laughs> no, you have you know, thing. I have a Yimbo. You have that you. thing. You have that thing, right? No, Yimbo. Yimbo's just play, just play along, Yimbo. I'm tossing you a softball. Yimbo's, Yimbo's too honest. <laughs> I can't lie. <laughs> can't lie. But Abraham could, Lincoln is also part of the Yimbo verse too. Could so, Yimbo uh, Reen lie? You was just looking around. He's like, I don't know what I'm holding for anybody. I, yeah, I'm looking around. I'm like, I I have toys. Oh no, yeah. you know what? Technically, well, it's not for you guys. I have that box that I have to send to Cal, <laughs> and I still have to tape up because this week has been insane. But uh... highly articulated does want to know how many of us on video have backed a walk epic all in. Show him. I did tonight. I did it. So, and then three, three out of five toy daddies agree. <laughs> I think it's amazing. I'm just, I have to look at my financial situation. That, that's where I'm at, too. I, I don't want to talk about it. I'm going to back you know. <laughs> And keep in mind, as I said earlier, I've been buying all of their stuff. I have all of their other figures. <laughs> I've been supporting know. and talking about these guys. Like, I love their stuff. So. I've left enough room like in the past <laughs> couple of weeks as to keep the epic all in as a possibility and tonight was when i just finalized it, i so. got i got a few more days jeez no draft highly articulated we are no doing draft. a draft that's, that's right no draft. highly articulated wants a draft yep and Good. i have one through five picks every single one of them all right so then wait you know one through five of like eight, 18 figures all right let's play all right <laughs> it's if, so good. if highly articulated wants a draft why don't we let highly articulated pick the theme of the next draft Ooh, I still think we should do an X Men draft. I think highly articulated should be the like the announcer during the draft. Ooh. I'm down with that. Wow. I'm down with that. I mean, yeah, we we we, God, we have so much to talk about besides X Men and I watched WrestleMania. Oh, you you watched did. oh my God! Yeah. Yeah, yeah, seriously, I missed yeah. that. I was drunk, got it. back. Yeah, I was I... drunk. Going, what's happening? You both John and John and WrestleMania with Chili. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I was dropping f bombs in the chat. I love that moment when you're like, how am I not on a stream with you guys? <laughs> Wait, hold up. Can you pull What's up, up Josh Brown's comment? All this time I've been playing. Yeah, I thought Josh 
had been had done an epic all in. No, That's no, he I asked. Know. He was the one that asked if I order one figure today. Can I epic all in tomorrow, like later? You got epic only now. Get the number up, Josh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I, I mean, it's time it's, that it's, we were epic all ins. It's a huge success already. They unlocked all the things off their initial launch. Um, I'm, uh, you know, I'm considering. Highly articulate says, "Let me know when and where. He'll be there. Do it." Uh, uh, any of us ordering the Good Toys One Twelve Rambler or not a Prowler? Yes. Yeah. I already ordered it. Yes. Isn't that? It's not coming to like what twenty twenty six twenty twenty nine something. Whenever. Like it 2099. It's a yeah, 2099. <laughs> At this point, we should just say coming soon. I you mean, know, yeah, the, fish, the worst you know, part about 5K toys is like I always get excited, order it right away, and then I'm just like completely forget about it later. Yeah, on. yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's our Where's our Citizen of Metropolis figure? Where's that? Oh, um, yeah. What about not not Wolverines? Oh. I didn't order that on 5K. I didn't order that one. Yeah, I I should have ordered. I didn't know it was going to five k weeks after, but yeah, I ordered it. So I Josh did. Brown, wait, wait, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Josh Brown, do not be ashamed, man. This is toys. Like, do not. Also, do not feel real pressure to do an epic all in, man. Like, this is this is just toys. We're just having yeah. fun. There's yeah. no shame. We're just trying to pressure you... each other on the stream. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's, it's really just different. us. Yeah. Josh yeah. Brown, if you really want to see the pressure as well, wait until like yeah. <laughs> if you're gonna be at least just no. gone. You know, we also do keep, some silly purchasing at that point too. Yeah, <laughs> keep, keep both your kidneys. Don't be like me. You know, the, just it's fine. You know, That's really why he's in Florida. That's why I'm in Florida. It's cheaper down here to have your kidney removed so you can sell it on the black market. I mean, what? Uh, <laughs> yeah, not you. You're talking uh, about five K. Oh yeah, like I I I totally just order and then forget. Yeah, you know. Um. So sometimes that I picked wanted. up. I really wanted that citizen of Metropolis. It's like the only Superman figure I've no, ever. No, he was in supposed to be here last. He was supposed to be here. Uh, in the I think fall. fall of yeah. last year. Pretty sure that was a 2023 order. Yeah. Yeah. Like or 2022 even. Many no, yeah. what did you pick up? It was last year, early, early last, last year. year. Yeah. yeah. All right, so, what you got, Mushy? What'd you get? Well, as you saw, I, I got Angel, yep. which is a good pick. Was really a nice. great yeah. figure. Nice. Really good figure. Um, I still want the blue one whenever that comes yeah, out in the future. If, yeah, if that comes out in the future, manage to find this and get this. Oh, wow, to toying around Ooh, toy con. Oh, wow, yep. Nice. And that Pikachu is articulated. Should, I, should I ask how much? You should not. Okay, moving on. First rule of toy hunting club, Chewie. It, Come on. <laughs> no, because I've, I've looked at that online before. I'm like, ooh, if you he has it. You ask in the chat privately. Yeah. Nice. I got the amazing Yamaguchi yeah, Wonder Woman, which is an older figure, but still a good one. Mm -hmm. um, Love the face plates. That's cool. Yeah, yeah. Actually, I didn't buy this, so Mario owed me money. Oh. So he was just trying to pay out his debt. Pretty much you. Walking down the aisle. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh man, I'm still waiting for Big Bad on mine. I'm also still waiting for my Gwen Yimbo. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did, that, did that come in? Yimbo, Yimbo just put her back in the box. I know, I'm going to have to. <laughs> they don't sell it anymore. It's gone. <laughs> Mario, Mario uh, bought those two figures for me because oh, okay. he owes me for the turtles. Gotcha. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. Turtle debt. Turtle debt. Oh, God, I know turtle debt. The most uh, common debt in the toy community. <laughs> the most common debt. <laughs> turtle debt. It's something we all, well, except for maybe Trevor. We all we all share a bond in. You know, Trevor has Star Wars debt. That's what that is. So. Yeah. yeah. And, well, he doesn't have a debt to mythics. No, no. no. That's, that's why I said Star Wars debt. Yeah, so uh, yeah. Josh Brown wants to know, what do you think of the jacket on Noir? Or Noire. I've heard of both of them. <laughs> It reminds me of uh, the Yamaguchi Gambit, which I was not too fond of. Ooh. It does, po it, I mean, it does get some cool poses, but it's just trying to balance it because it throws it off balance, right? Mm. It's it's a heavy plastic. I don't know. Gotcha. I can open it. Yeah, yeah. why not? Yeah, yeah open it. it. Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> Chewie, you still have control, right? So we can do yeah. top 10, or is there no top 10 tonight? Uh, this is top 10. 
And we got our normal uh, slide deck and all. Um, Chris, did you want to run it? And then we'll just add to the share on the screen. Sure. Yeah. That's I, just, I want to make sure we get to your guys' part too. I don't want to, you know, I want to, to get lost. People are I mean, here. I mean, this is early for that. us. Um, normally that's we that. get to the. Get to no, the actual I, show, I love show it. part this after 10 o'clock. This is fantastic. Yeah. Oh, what oh. happened to my stream? Oh, my God. <laughs> Who's doing that, Matthew? This, 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 <laughs> okay. this is when we get bumped. We get bumped to the bottom now. Oh. <laughs> Sad and low. Well, we kind of talked about this, but what's making us happy right now? Um, J-Shock? Uh, honestly, just I, I'll be honest with you. Like, you know, everybody's like, oh, you get to travel to work. It's so exciting. It's like. Sometimes traveling for work, especially like extended period of time, like like I'm I'm on day four, so familiar faces and uh, familiar voices are uh, are nice. You know, it makes you feel like home a little bit. So I'm uh, I'm actually very thankful to to have a a extended stream tonight when we thought we may not even have a stream. Um, so uh, yeah, I mean, and, we, were, and look, we it, weren't even supposed it, to be here today. Wasn't even supposed to be my day off. Um, <laughs> So I'm, I'm thankful for that, but uh, I'm also, you know, I said in the beginning of the stream too, uh, a rough day on set today, but a bad day on set is better than a good day in the office. So um, happy to be happy to be doing what I'm doing today. That's awesome. When are you going back home? Uh, Friday morning. I have like a like a stupid like 5 a.m. Like the birds are like, why are you up? <laughs> like so, uh, tough thing is, <laughs> I go from a full week here. I've been here since Sunday. Full week here, Friday. 8 a.m. flight. I think I landed 8 a.m. or something like that. And I go right into dance competition weekend. Heck so yeah. uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, dance competition mode, and then back to the office on Monday. So there is no time for That's nothing. right. For people in the chat unaware, Jay Shaw is actually a classically trained dancer. And he's I am. competing this weekend. I am. Is it uh, I, got, I got these twinkle toes and, uh, you know, like Fred Astaire on one of the big guys. In the words of Mike Wazowski, big guys really are light on their feet. So, you know, that's how it, uh, that's how it works. You were a Jabberwocky, so. And we're ja Jabberwocky. Yeah. Oh, no, no, I was the Jabberwocky. <laughs> oh, you both right. were. Jabber between two Jabberwockies was the original. You couldn't tell with those masks. You couldn't tell with those masks. So. Mm -hmm. Wait a second. We're missing this. Look that's at this. how they met. This gem is, is sneaking by us. Trevor says he has the 5K turtles. And I do have the myth, myth, the mythic dead. Mythical dead, actually. I'm a completist. That's true. I love that. Mm. Um, Jay Shot is totally a dance dad. Oh, I thought Jay Shot was a stripper. No, Dom, not a stripper. No one wants to see this unless you pay nineteen ninety nine for the OnlyFans. Um, <laughs> and yes, once I am, a, I'm definitely a dancer. Uh, oh, you're yes, not a paint I'm stripper? A, no, not a paint stripper. Different, very different. Stripper. Oh. Jay Shot and tight, tight tights. Uh, yeah, there you go. So, <laughs> uh, Machu, what's making you happy right now, buddy? Uh. Right now, being home, sleeping on my own bed. Um, it was fun. Oh. Canada was fun, right? Uh, did you go it. around to all the sites in in Toronto, or did you go to we, that Needle Tower or CNN Tower or whatever that is? No, we didn't go there, but we did stop at Niagara because we had to go to a show. Canada is, Niagara uh, is the best. Yeah, but it was so it was Saturday that we went, and then we were like really worried about the traffic for mm -hmm. the eclipse because a lot of people were going to niagara and staying there mm. just for the eclipse yeah was and that in the room, line totality yeah wow and then it was super cloudy <laughs> so the wow. rooms there the, the hotel rooms there were like 800 to like a thousand a night right yeah just for the eclipse damn and they didn't see it because it was so cloudy oh my gosh yeah well so Got to hang out some, some different peeps, you know. Mm -hmm. yeah. It was really poutine. cool. Some, some oh, I, there was so much poutine. How good is poutine? Was that oh your first God. time having poutine? No, 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 no. It's not my first time. Okay. But it is good. I had uh, uh, Korean fried chicken. Had Ooh. duck and waffles for breakfast. That was really good. Ooh, nice fried duck or is how's it the, like, yeah? How was the duck prepared? It was uh, not for uh, it like was grilled. Beef. Yeah, interesting. But, but the uh, con was uh, a big success. Yes, yes. There was a lot of so I I mentioned this to Kev. I'm like I obviously I go to a lot of cons in Jersey, right? So it's like uh, I, I you've been I, known. 
yeah i've been i've been i, I dabble in a, a bunch of conventions and i've you know been behind the table of a few with j shot mm-hmm. and, and i told him and yimbo yes and yimbo too yeah. we were behind Sorry, the yimbo. table with these two but whatever okay <laughs> <laughs> That's Fine. true. I With forgot. all of us, but whatever. He did, he did say he did say New Jersey, though. He did say New Jersey. Fine. Fine. Yeah. Fine. <laughs> well, like I did. I, 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 I didn't him. take offense, Macho. That's fair. I never really hung out behind the table. <laughs> That's true. You weren't even there. I was just posing the figures on the table in front of the table. But um I did tell Kev, I'm like, you have a good assortment of different vendors. It's not only yeah. um, you know, people just selling junk from their attic or mm-hmm. they went to target and just bought a bunch of toys and flipping oh, it you know yeah. oh so yeah. they had like good stuff good stuff i had some good stuff there nice. yeah surprisingly i did see the punk set really yeah considering oh. that they don't have a target there it is interesting hmm. yeah. somebody drove it up mm-hmm. across the border with it mm-hmm. um so real real quick uh flint cob uh a guy who should watch b2s yes you should uh, but not enough. What does John do? First off, no one said my name is John, so careful. Uh, no, I'm kidding. Uh, <laughs> I, I, I won't say what company I work for, but I am a, uh, I'm the basically the creative director for an internal agency. So uh, I get to do cool stuff every once in a while. So, And uh, the J stands for Jitterbug. I love interacting with Trevor because Trevor's always on TPC streams, but he very rarely comes hangs out with us. So I love this well, now. You- so you yeah. see, the problem is, is you got rid of your car, so you don't have car that problems. Joke is for him to hop on. We're done. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. For me to hop on. Yeah. Uh, but uh, yeah. And uh, this was good. I think this D Blake, D Blake, and uh, and Nick immediately continued it. This is great, right? <laughs> on, the ball, on, the on, main the main on the main stage. Hey, you're on the main stage. That's the, that's the an honor. Yeah. I'm so happy yeah. for you. Yeah. <laughs> On deck is Toy it. Father. <laughs> Seven a.m. On though. Tuesday. I wouldn't. I wouldn't be on the main stage though. So. <laughs> uh, yeah, but what's making you happy, buddy? Oh boy, it's been nice weather finally. Last week was yes. garbage in New Jersey, and that was my spring break. <laughs> So this week, uh, it's been good. The last couple of days, track season started. So just getting outside, um, very sore by leading, just of minimal exercises. <laughs> and uh, Chewy, you're going to love this, man. On Saturday, we get to see Bluey live. So thanks to my mom. And <laughs> like, on Sunday, up the kids. you get to watch the, the triple long Bluey special, the sign. Which which I saw a thread. Paste? I saw a Threads post that said, "Like, hey, Sorry. parents of parents of young kids, like they're not okay right now because of the Bluey situation happening." Well, isn't <laughs> like, like check in on with you? Admit, I'm I'm not okay. Isn't yeah. there some theory that like th- there's something going on, like they're gonna start running from the cops or something because they like put their house up for sale? Oh, that's a fun theory. Like, yeah, how, like how I, does dude, I, these two I afford in. this house that has endless bathrooms and endless bedrooms <laughs> at the top of a hill? in australia and the idea is that um bandit is a um he, he's like an indiana jones character like right. he, he he's, like, an architect. he's a archaeologist yeah yeah and chili works for tsa which by the way think about that right chili sniffs he's is a bomb dog chili sniffs for the bombs mm-hmm. and bandit is a digger so the notion is that they're smuggling artifacts <laughs> yeah Wait, like, so a dark bluey theory. <laughs> What's the sad news about Bluey? Oh, they just it's put up a tease at the very end that they're selling the house, and so yeah. it's signaling that whatever iteration this is, it, it's coming to a close. Yeah. Oh, yeah. god! But, but that does mean I think it's a false flag. But Bluey toys going on, on sale, right? Yeah, Bluey <laughs> has is a target. <laughs> Amazing! Yeah, the Bluey collab. So yeah. it's an all buy, right? We're all going to get buy, more Bluey buy. toys. Yeah. yeah, but probably as soon as, as soon as we explain to Machi what Bluey is. <laughs> yep. It's, it's Just a, like X Men, right. Bluey makes you cry. <laughs> oh my god! Can we do an intro? We can, the next time we're together, we got to film an intro like that. 
Right. Oh, doing the, doing the dance? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And this is officially a Toy Daddy's episode. Great. <laughs> We're talking about this cartoon dog family meant for children. It's so <laughs> good. It's so good. I like that. Nice. That's a good Great one. Great idea. Great idea. I think I'm going to keep him in this boat. Yeah, great idea. D Blake, I'm with you. D Blake watches Blue by himself. Sorry, Yimbo, go ahead. Something's making you happen. Oh no, that was that was that, those are all the things I'm looking forward to. You and know what, hanging you know out what with you guys. Me and... Happy Imbo is that you were on spring break all last week and we didn't stream during the day once. Yeah, seriously. Things Yimbo. have changed, what Yimbo. You changed. You sp- I, <laughs> I was hey, making Yimbo. Yimbo, I'm really glad you got to enjoy your spring break. I was hustling making videos. That's <laughs> like the big thing that I've been trying to focus on. So that's you that took my stream with my, us. You were in Canada. I don't want to... <laughs> Yeah, but that was only on Thursday when the earthquake happened, by the way. That was Friday. And that messed and me Friday. up. I, I'm Roger, trying not to... Much you would have let, done a stream from the plane. Would have been up yeah. How's that, that plane Wi-Fi? I don't know. It's not great. No, I, wouldn't have paid for the, I wouldn't have paid for the Wi-Fi for that short of when, flight. When, whenever I travel um, overseas, they, they make a point to say there's no streaming on the plane. Oh, wow. Really? <laughs> Well, they have smaller tubes on the plane, right? For the internet. Smaller tubes. The tubes, no? You guys remember that reference? It's because the tubes are uh, in metric. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's take you off the picture. <laughs> uh, no chewing. What's making you happy, bud? Um, my, kids <laughs> my kids are really into Harry Potter right now. So we got through number seven. The movie? Or yeah, the, the seventh um, movie. And um, the kids are super into it, so it's super exciting around the house. Like, they, they want to talk about it, the birthday themes, Lego sets, all that stuff. Um, the, the flip side of it is that they keep wanting to go further and further. And my son's six. And we got to the point, spoilers, if people haven't seen this 15-year-old movie and 20-year-old <laughs> book. But um, in the seventh one with Dobby Dies. <laughs> It was a dark moment in the house. <laughs> so I have to explain that. Be like, honey, I forgot to hit pause. Shoot. <laughs> Did you see that people like today still go to that, like where they shop at and leave stones for him and socks? Oh, really? On the beach? Yeah. Wow. I know that you can. Um... Where is that? I don't know. Over on the other, you know, over on the place we were both in the UK. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's on a beach somewhere, Toy Father. I don't know if that it was a collective we, but okay. Um, <laughs> you know, like all of us, like Americans, we all revolted from that place. Yeah. So, yeah. Okay. The, the United Kingdom. Yeah. And now they won't take us back. Even Maybe on the Hamilton version so, for us. Yeah. But, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Watch Hamilton. Yeah. You guys are like in a. You guys are near a pretty important part of that history too. Like you know. Just saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We overlook that all the time. All those field trips are so yeah. boring. Yeah, well, I mean, yeah, okay. Yeah, I get it. Um, what's making you, Chris? Did you say um, you happy, Well, well Chris, I'm glad you guys asked. <laughs> uh, much like Yimbo, uh, sports season started. I'm coaching both of my daughters in softball, and it's only taken me four years to understand how to run a practice. So we've been running practices. It's been going great. I've been having a lot of fun, and it's good to get outside. And just like Gimbo, my legs are sore. Um, Mm -hmm. And uh, just doing this, like uh, work has been super stressful, but at the same time, it's good to hang out, sharpen my axe, and uh, hang with the toy daddies and um, the sentinels and having fun with you guys. So. I think Machu has left a proxy. He is gone now. So, uh, oh, what's making you happy, Nora? Eh? <laughs> um, if we can go back to. Oh. Oh, oh, all right. Here you go. Whoop, whoop, nope. I got. I got. Oh, oh, no, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to oh, our hundred count. The race to 100. Is Ma- is Machu putting up like a board? What's happening here? He's trying to yes. he's trying to isolate the yeah he's trying to isolate it so you really you that looks so cool. Oh please, we just got to the slide. 
Nice. Oh, you. Oh, oh, man, hey. Watch you. Hey, guys. No, that's, that's really good, but on that white sign, whenever you have to take a pee break, you should have a little, like, be back sign. Back yeah. <laughs> be back at five. Enjoy these posed figures. <laughs> that, well, that's an that. entire show right there. Yeah. <laughs> Enjoy these posed figures. That's so cool. Wow. 46? Okay. Yep. Race to 100. Added uh, Triple H that you have, you're holding for me. Um the KO um 299, not Mikey. Um, I think that's it for me. Oh, not Prowler. <laughs> should, we, should we call the KO 2099 not Miguel? <clears throat> not Miguel. <laughs> not Miguel. <laughs> I mean, this one's just blatantly trying to be Miguel. I'm just <laughs> it's got a better head sculpt. It does. Two. Two. It was twenty dollars. I got some sort of promo code on it. <laughs> that's that awesome. Twenty dollars shipped. I don't understand how that works. Uh, but I'll take it. So yeah, well, at the very least, mine's sixty because of that. Because of Mikey. Think. Oh, uh, sixty-one. Did you 61. count uh, Giant Man Wasp? Oh, Giant sixty-two. Man sixty-two. Oh shit! Did you count Watch the Wolverine you. that I brought home for you? Well, I didn't buy that. So that doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> no, unless I'm paying. Unless I'm spending That's true. money. That's true. That's true. Yambo's is about money. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Um, well, I'll charge you for it then. Shoot, sixty-four. <laughs> <laughs> what do they charge like that? <laughs> you gotta pay the bat fee. Oh, the, gotta, bat. Yeah. the tax coming back from Canada. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> but yeah, uh, and then I'm still torn about that Prowler figure. I just don't know. <sighs> I might cancel mine. It does look kind of wonky on the. Do you, do you think we'll get something? Like before that figure actually ships, that's my concern, right? That you'll we'll actually have something in it hand. It depends on when the movie ship. comes out. Yeah, and isn't the movie on hold indefinitely right now? Indefinitely. Is it? Indefinitely. Yeah. Indefinitely. Yeah. yeah. Really? Well, yeah. when they went on strike, all the actors confirmed they haven't voiced anything. Yeah. I yeah. knew that. Yeah. So they have to voice it, and then they ha they probably have you know do a little bit of ad libbing, changing from there. Mm. It it's probably next year, but who knows. I, don't, I wouldn't bet on next year. If it, if it hasn't gone into production yet, I wouldn't bet on next it was year. It supposed to be 11 days ago. <laughs> <sighs> That's sad. Well, My father's in the lead. Uh, with 68, with all, all those, actually 69, because I added a Wasp and Ant-Man. Um, but then, uh, that counts as one. It's one purchase. Well, it counts as one? Yeah, yeah the turtles only count as one as well. Dude. Dude, this is an hour and forty. Which turtles? This is a lot of freaking math that we've done on this podcast. It's a lot um, of math. Here. But then I just backed the epic all in, which is how many figures? It counts as one. You're fine. Counts as 13. one. Counts as one. That should not count as one. Uh, as one. How many buttons did you have to? Did you select it, figures? You, it does you press one? I will not count it as, as a card. One. <laughs> I will not <laughs> count it as <laughs> one. Why not? Three That's, boxes. Look three how boxes. Is three. Look at how angry. Because he's counting it as one. It should be counted as one. The turtle set was one. Yeah, okay. these I mean, two packs count as one. I mean, I guess that's yeah, but you fair. can't you can't get those you can't get the TMNT set individually bought. That's true. You can't. Ah, uh, so, I see what you're saying. And uh, and Messi says, doing my due diligence. Quick reminder that we are on the fourth month of twelve, and everyone is pretty much halfway to our so, uh, Yeah. No, 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 no that's not, not everyone. I'm already over that number. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm over it. So, how, how many figures is the Epic All-In right now? 13. Because I was staring at it. Yeah, yeah okay. 13 figures plus four All head right. packs or weapon packs. Uh, okay, so, okay, 72, something like that. No, 82, sorry. Well, okay. We're almost there, guys. We're almost You're there. Almost there? Congratulations. <laughs> you did it. Yeah, I, think, I think it's only been 100 days into the year. I mean, I gotta say, I've gone on Hinge this week, this month. I, it, you can tell when I'm stressed when all of my when those purchases start to go up the up the ladder. So you need that serotonin hit. <laughs> all right, some toy news. We talked a little bit about this. Not a Miguel. No, no, no. no, that, no, no. That, that's 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 knockoff twenty ninety nine. This is this is oh. 
You were talking yeah. about that, Miguel. Got it. Yeah. Not go- <laughs> I guess calling not- us Miguel would be pretty funny. <laughs> we're, not, we're not buying a knockoff version of Go Figure Go either. I just want to make that clear. Yeah. <laughs> this one looks cool. I like the uh, skateboard. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I like so what I like about it is a lot of people were, and I think I mean it was in the uh, the turtle chat uh, you know that we're in. A lot of people were worried that they didn't go to the samurai because they kept showing the Mikey head with the headphones, and there was concern oh. about the samurai look and continuing the wave. So I think seeing this really shows how it's it's pretty cool that they uh, they did continue the samurai, so that matches everything up. I don't know why he's called the crossbow master. He doesn't even come with a crossbow. Oh, he's got two little crossbows. Oh, yeah, two yeah, little yeah, ones that yeah, go on the wrist. Yeah, but. Yeah. But yeah, but this is this is a I will say this is the extra um custom kit that you get kind of like sets this into a time period because all the others you would think it would be I would say like a feudal Japan samurai era. Yeah. But like he's the only one to come with more modern stuff, like a skateboard, the spray can, the headphones, things like that. So I think it's interesting. It kind of this set a uh it set the the tone for where they are in the world, so to speak. Yeah. I hope they I do another, um, you know, add-on pack where this sure they will. this one was like those four little turtles and three head sculpts to go for Donnie okay. and Leo because I want m- not Mikey to have the the samurai helmet. Does, oh, Thanos! I didn't realize Donnie has techie stuff. I, does he have techie stuff too? He, yes. He's got the arm, right? The arm extend backpack. Oh, okay. oh yeah, he has like a little radar dish and extender arm. I always imagined it. That these turtles are like modern day. They just are influenced by certain aspects, right? Like Leo is influenced by more from samurai. I just the way that they were all being called samurai masters, and the way that is, I mean, the only one that I've had in hand is Leo. So I just assumed, like I went with, they were based off of you know kind of the uh, the the mythos there of when they were back in Japan. So. Uh, Proven wrong again. Maybe it's oh, an no, interpretation of like um, they go back in time, but they have all their stuff with them. Cool. Well, hey. hey, there's nothing. There's nothing written for this. We can make it up as we go. So, but yeah, definitely um, pre-ordered this one. Yeah. Yeah. I I am super excited for how Raph is like a hulking monster compared to the rest of the brothers from like that one test image did render or proto whatever it was. There was one picture i saw of it a while back bite me and... digs <laughs> <laughs> but um, for the record my, my wife called me from target the other over the weekend when she was running out of the store and she's like hey I, you know just checking the toys and I, i'm in the NECA section and um was there anything you're looking for i was like no nah, not at walmart she's like are you sure there's these turtles that look like in sam i was like no 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 sorry cody no <laughs> <laughs> they look like, what? Hey, hey, Cody's in the morning. Back off, man. Oh, I love Cody. I know. It's this is <laughs> yeah. TMNT three talk. <laughs> oh, oh. Well, it's looking pretty good. I mean, he might be onto something. <laughs> All right. Well, let's move on to the not top ten yet. Yeah, for all of the month of April, use hashtag TPC underscore Epic Epi Colin, um, Epi Colin yeah. <laughs> to support uh, a walk. But also, if you want your photo to be uh, featured on the uh, TPC um, Instagram page, we'll be on bonus points. Is, bonus points if you feature an Epi Pen. That's what this is, right? <laughs> That's yeah. dark. Great shot, Diggs Figs. By the way, yeah, awesome shot. Thanks, Diggs. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I picked this one for Yimbo. Yimbo, what do you like about this photo? It, it's, it has a figure that is sitting in Teterboro, New Jersey. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's busy. Clearly, he's busy uh, in uh, yeah, New Jersey. Business, so. This is your figure, actually. This this was made by the guy who's waiting to give you your figure. He was playing with it. <laughs> now, this is really great action. Um, John, there was somebody in our turtle chat, and I almost ended up sending a picture that I did uh it was like oh if i you know get the, the figure that stands around i'm like these figures can move oh, so yeah. this is a really nice like exhibit you know example of just how articulated uh this particular line is 
Yeah, no, we won't we won't name names, but somebody was like hating on those figures, and I was like, you clearly haven't. Like, if you're gonna hate on anything in these figures, hate on how small they are. But that's yeah, it. sure. And like I said, I can't wait for Raph. Like, did you yeah. see how large he is compared so, to the rest of them? I haven't so, seen. I, I don't figure. think I've seen Raph. Right? Oh my god, guys! He's Yimbo, go find it, please. Oh. I want to see it. Yimbo, go find it. Yimbo, <laughs> go go search. Google that, please. <laughs> on it. <laughs> go ahead, Chris. Right on. Right on top of that, Rose. <laughs> I picked this one. Um, story motion, a beautiful angle. This figure's awesome. So, no, no, um, no surprise. Um, I picked this one. Lex collects. Uh, I think we got a glimpse of maybe this mutant. I don't want to spoil anything. Maybe he he was on show last night um but i really do love this perspective um so simple and they did a great job oh let's go to the top yeah. 10 top 10 the toy master um i nominated this photo and i was really happy because uh i just stumbled upon this uh account and i was like wow i really like uh his photos and um, I thought this was really cool kind of, uh, idea that he did blending a, uh, I believe that's a photo with, um, the cap. So yeah. ultimate cat. Yeah. This is a great picture, man. So you were in cat mode with playing with that Marvel select, right? Yeah. I was definitely in cat mode. I, I didn't even think about it, but yeah, I was definitely in the cat mode. Yeah. What's cool about that ultimate cat figure is it does play into this like World War II style. It you know, like is it is just a classic look for him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a great picture. Nice editing. Yeah, really yeah, nice. I editing. like the sepia tones a lot on it. It's good. Well we do have some answers from the what? Toy Master. Nice. So here we go. He's a hi there. Thank you for the nomination. So World War II was the biggest and deadliest war in history, and I wanted to capture and Captain America was perfect to represent that time period. And what's making them happy right now is, wow, the toy community is amazing. Love how the community supports each other. And it's his first time in the top 10, and I'm glad for the opportunity to be a part of it and hit us with a Toys for Life. <laughs> so there you go. <laughs> and that is that is a beautiful sentiment. because Yes. I like I like the way you're saying the toy master and I it like it's like giving me Ghostbuster vibes, right? Like, are you the are you the toy master? Like, I'm the gatekeeper, are you the toy master? Or like Batman the animated series. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, yeah, good wanna... stuff, man. Yeah, uh yeah, great stuff. Thank you, Toy Master. Um, I don't know if the audio is working, uh, Yimbo for the slideshow, but if it's not your computer doesn't work number nine. <laughs> I don't I think I may have spelled this wrong. <laughs> I don't look this one up. I, I'm I'm on it. I'm on it. Epi Colin? Uh, yeah. Epi Colin. Yeah. Um well hey, uh Machu, what do you think about this photo? No, you got it right. Did I? Oh, okay. Yeah. I just I want to know what he's using. Is that like to make the force field that, yeah. that uh, Magneto has? I want to oh. know what, what they're using. It looks that. it looks familiar. Like it it doesn't. It looks familiar. There's something like we. I feel like it's something we all have. Is it not right. the SH figure arts? Like, um, didn't they have like? Oh, no, I don't think that's the water one. I don't know what that is. It actually, you know, what it looks like it looks like smoke. Like if you took the tail end of smoke coming in. Yeah, hmm. but it is it is a plastic it looks great though. thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like the use of Magneto and Wolverine there here. Go. Okay. And then reuse down and in the corner too. Pick. Yeah. Well, oh, I didn't uh, even realize that was Ryu. Yeah. Tang oh. Toy Photography is in the chat. Nine out twenty-eight. And we do have answers as well. So. Oh, uh, uh, jury storm collectibles effect. Okay. Oh, okay. 
All right. <clears throat> so this is really cool. Um, this is one of those opportunities for everybody to jump on board with a relatively new account. Uh, Tang Toy Photos just started in December. Wow. So only at 144 followers, which again, followers don't mean anything at all. It's about the content of your, you know, the quality of your work. But since it is a newer account, again, we always like to remind everybody that is that if, whenever you find somebody new to you, go track them down, show them some love, give them a follow, and uh, and go check out their work. So here we go. Four questions. Um, the story behind the picture was inspired by Fatal Attractions X-Men 25, where Wolverine lunges at Magneto, only to get wrecked shortly after. These are great pictures, too. Look at that. Oh, All go right. back. See, I like that one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, what is making them happy right now is, well, this hobby is extremely addictive. We know. <laughs> we, all aspects of it. Yes, highly addictive. And fun and has me conjuring up scenarios inspired by comics and popular media. Not to mention the toy community via the Discord. All right, all right. Especially is really fun, lively, and imaginative to interact with. This is my first competition in toy photography, so it kind of blew my mind that I get into the top 10 on the first try. That is fantastic. Yeah, man. Congratulations. Really nice job. Looks like you got some copper wiring in that like cotton style explosion, yeah. which is great. Really nice. Yeah, that's really nice. Congratulations. Very cool. Congrats. Yimbo. Number eight. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> Fitting the vibe of the picture. Kaiju dot pew. Exactly. You nailed it. <laughs> <laughs> nailed it. <laughs> um. No, Chang, what do you think? It's a really cool shot. I'm just trying to figure out how the um they must have added that in post, right? Uh, the guessing the little like saliva. saliva. The saliva is a, yeah. That's the way it, what caught my eye immediately. Outside yeah. of the just, nah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah, I'm always I'm always enamored by people that can edit that well. That's Unless it's a... not, is it practical? Could it be a drippy drip? It could, it could be a drippy, like drippy, drippy. drippy. It could be. Hmm. It could be. I mean, that. I like the little. I like the little hints of light change coming in at the bottom too. Yeah. Like a little bit more yeah. depth. Yeah. yeah. Really good touch. Yeah. Can't but also can't believe this shot is number eight. That's pretty epic. So. And uh, this is a, what Neca, right? I think so. Yeah, NECAs are over so good. Again, like I mean, one of my oh, you know suggestions to early toy photographers, people starting out, like at least from what I discovered in my own work, was like filling the frame and close up portraits. So you can really make your your you know your toys look realistic, and uh, NECA is awesome for that type of stuff. Wow, because they look beautiful. Ooh, Dig said that could be clear tub of Elmer's glue. Interesting. Really? Okay. That could be neat, man. That kind of makes me want to do that with Venom. Yes. You know, because I've never, I, I, I know I don't have the, the Photoshop or editing ability to do it digitally. So, but practical, that's my jam. <laughs> this weekend, this weekend, Yumbo. After Bluey. Do, 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 do. <laughs> yeah, or just use the tears from your face to do it. <laughs> oh my God. Uh oh, what happened? Oh, the tears oh. from your face. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh shoot! That one what? is cool. Oh, it's oh. broken. And oh. Yeah. oh, who does that? That Ash? Is that SHF? SHF. Can yeah. we also comment on how Toy Father just said that Ash? That Ash. Oh. <laughs> that my ash. my Ash. <laughs> 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 wow, that one's cool. Made a bum cover. <laughs> how has this not been reissued or yeah. updated or just i mean even just a re-release oh his does hat SH comes off does SH shf are they known for doing that re-releases or not really not really um, yeah right i'm trying to think no. of. Backwards, backwards. 
Not like Moffat. Put the hat backwards. Back. Back. You can see mm. the Pikachu better. You want me to put that one's so cool. Go to the next number. Oh, uh, uh, come back. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, wait, do we have answers? Number we jump in the gun here. Um, so this is this this was the. Um, a repeat from September. I'm not a repeat, but um, Kaiju. We we talked about uh, one of their photos <laughs> back in se- <laughs> Pew Pew no, Kaiju Pew. <laughs> uh, back in September, he, uh, they made the top ten. Um, and again, it's just congratulatory that I got to send the questions again. And uh, they said, "Thanks, brother. I got you in a bit. My daughter has my hands tied right now." And then I never it, it got a response. But again, there's a little bit of a time you know difference. So, Kaiju Poo, congratulations, man. Really spectacular. Uh, awesome work on the soft. There's a shot. So, yeah. So, there you go. <laughs> Number seven. Ooh. Now it works. Oh. Shaliza. I thought it was Shaliza. Shaliza? Yeah. I th- <laughs> yeah. I thought it was Shaliza. <laughs> it's okay. Fine. You speak Percy yeah. and Bo every time with this name. <laughs> she does such great work she does. so so awesome um and love love uh her behind the scenes reels you know like it really gets to show how she achieves all of this like practical because it's all practical all the any of you you know get look at any of her stuff um she's got the dirt kicking up in motorcycles you know the dirt flying the, the actually if you want to bring one up to it's just like even her recent stuff is just very cool to like see how she puts this all into work i'm sure she probably has something like if i had to guess she probably filmed a behind the scenes of this picture too because that looks like fire <laughs> um is that uh what is, what is this one is this the mafex or is this the NECA? oh yeah there we go whoa Wow. And safe for the figures, presumably. Uh, real fire. <laughs> yeah. That's very close to a wall, by the way. Uh, it yeah. looks, somehow it looks safer, but not than Sir, what Sir Dork does. It looks a little bit more controlled, but also not. I mean, oh, they're, never mind. They're squirting the lighter fluid right onto that. Not oh, safer. yeah. Not safer. No. Is that like some sort of dio? Like, no, I do it on top resistant. of it. They're outside, though. Let's give them credit for being outside. Mm hmm. Oh. That is definitely like a dio, though. But what I wonder what fo- foam is that? A could that be dough? That would melt, right? I mean, it might be far enough back. I don't know. I mean, it doesn't look like the flame lasts. Very no, long. it doesn't last very long. It's just no. I'm, I'm always worried about that. Like, it can always splash off of something and go onto the wall. Mm. I've almost burnt my garage down as a kid doing something like this that's why i worry mm. 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 i played with fire I, I almost burned a place yeah. down too matt when i was little <laughs> this is why i won't mess with fire as a toy photographer <laughs> i mean i'll yeah. do it but i won't do it near any like buildings yeah but again uh shallows stuff is really tremendous and highly like yeah definitely worth checking out um especially for all of these behind the scenes you can pick up so many different tips and tricks yeah she's a she's just a great person in the toy community too yeah so. <laughs> fantastic did uh that was well, this, we, this... Didn't, we didn't get any answers okay but um always up for answers after the fact so Shaliza, if you see this and you want to send them back, that'd be great. But great job, number seven, with this amazing photo. Imbo. Six! Ooh, Slay's like Toys. Oh, Chewie, you nominated this one, right? Was that you? Or was it? It was. Yeah. Is it me? Oh, so, yeah. This is me. So what do you think? No, I love it. It's fantastic. Um, has that you using that awesome uh Spider-Man anime series head sculpt on the Mezco buck. I love you know, Yeah, that was cool. People that have these dial setups, it just makes it look so natural to have something like this. 
And once again, Chris and I always point to like the ground texture. That's why I like working on my own Dio flooring has been a big thing for me. Mm -hmm. um, because it really like you could see just how how much that enhances the realism of it. What have you like? I mean, I'm not to put you on the spot, but have you like learned anything? Have you like what are you like working on in terms of like the flooring texture? Oh, well, just even just making um, like, a, you know, my a better version of because like, you know, back here, this was my first attempt at making like street and it was just me painting and putting the lines on. So I was never thrilled with how it turned out because it has no texture to it. It's just painted on. But my ensuing ones, like when I made the larger base for my 78 uh, Mirage, so I can like really spread that out. That one, <clears throat> I used a Lone Wolf Labs tip, which was to just use a rock and just beat the hell out of it and just pummel it. Um, I found recently a roll of cork board, which is something that um, Mike High School Creations has used in the past too. That's good for, yeah, asphalt. For, for asphalt. So that, that will be an eventual thing I will want to try out. But um, for now, literally, I just took from my backyard this hand-sized big rock and just whop, whop, whop. <laughs> just and and then that really did help and then i painted it afterwards so i beat the hell you, out of it first yeah you can also you know you could always call one of us if you want to talk <laughs> um question though you, you said you took the rock and you went womp womp and then you painted it afterwards yes did painting the rock help create more texture is that what no i didn't paint what do you mean i didn't paint the rock <laughs> You can't paint it. the rock. He's too big. He's, he's massive. He's, he's, he's the final, final boss. boss. <laughs> <laughs> no one paints rock in the corner. That's right. Nobody paints rock. Right. <laughs> but yeah, well, this have, is great. I have some answers. Um, the story behind my shot is pretty simple. I wanted to capture what it would look like catching Spidey, suiting up, and getting ready to protect the city. I felt like I wanted to do something a little different, which is where the Hasbro Peter Parker head sculpt came into play. My dial from Grime City worked oh, yeah. really oh, with the shot in the rest of this story. Yeah. I think what what I love about this too is like the positioning of the head and the hair sweep like gives yeah. it like you know like it almost feels like you could you can feel the wind kind of moving, but also that like shadow that hits across the eye. Like the yeah. shadow underneath with the light hitting the eyes, it's it's really great. Yeah, yeah the amazing um his post from today was uh, one of the came, com, common writers. Common writers? Is that how you say it? Common writers? Common writer, yeah. Um, and on Instagram, the caption was very simple. But over on X, he had a longer thing about, again, like discussing shadowing, you know, because obviously he's so big into lighting and how it can change the mood of a, a photo. And yeah, like something like this is really cool. <laughs> I really like that sh that the light just ac across this figure because i love this figure i was just that was another one i'm just messing around with by the way i wanted to ask you guys i i've started getting the shoulder creases which i'm not actually too mad about because this is like a figure i'm going to just keep forever and it kind of i don't mind it getting a little beat up but do i remember you guys saying like a hair dryer will help bring that vinyl back together or no i don't know you gotta yeah, paint the hair dryer sure. first though <laughs> what were you saying, Matt? I, I, I don't think it'll fully help, but it can help when you're before you get the cracks. But once you get the cracks, that's it. Oh, all right. Well, I don't really, you know, like Yimbo, I said, because this, this is what you do, Yimbo. You um cut a hole in the back, you pull <laughs> off the suit, you give it to Machu, and have him find you a Spider Man Rebel Tech 1.0 buck. <laughs> yeah. You don't Did that happen on yours, Matt? Did this happen yeah. on yours? It actually happened before I even switched the switched the buck. Yeah, did it uh, has it? Just the Mezco buck itself. Right. Do you? Uh... I miss. I used. To, I was massaging it every night. <laughs> okay. Does it still? Did it make you sad? Like I don't. It doesn't. It's really like doesn't really bother me. I don't think I'm gonna mind if this. I don't know. Maybe I'm just trying to tell myself not to get sad about it. Don't get sad about sad it. Don't, don't be sad about it. Just I just. I time. just. Watch you massages this distance theater every night. It's okay. Yeah. yeah. Hashtag massage every night. <laughs> um, 
Quick hello yep. to uh, Jurassic Jesse and uh, Collection Nexus. How's it going? Hey, guys. Uh, Slay's Toys also says, right now, I think what's making me happiest in our tar community has to be all the love and support that hold on, love and support our toy community has um, shows us each and every day. It's truly remarkable how many people are showing regular support from one another. Awesome. I, I do love this photo a lot. I like it a lot. Yeah, yeah John, now that you mentioned that light, that's really good. Right? That's yeah. where it is. And the hair that was like barn doors, right? right? Like, um, if you... Yeah, you close it. Yeah. yeah. Or you could... You know what you could do, too? And it's actually... We don't talk about this enough. Black aluminum foil that you can get from, like, a B&H or a leg supply store is perfect because it molds like aluminum foil, but it's matte black, so it doesn't reflect light. So you oh. can really, like... Yeah, it's it's some good stuff. Ooh. It's it's pricey. I mean, pricey for aluminum foil. But it's it pricey for the stuff. roll. Yeah, but once you have it, it's reusable. It's not like because you don't care if it creeps or not. Right? Like you're not you're not looking at it. So what what's it called? A, uh, I think it's called black foil. Actually, black cinefoil. Foil. Uh, cinefoil. Uh, I think there's there might be two brands, but yeah, it's something along those lines. So. It's, it's, it's also good for Thanksgiving. You're in a pinch. You have no, 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 no. No, you don't use it for that. No, 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 no. I'm just joking, John. God. No, well, don't I don't want to get anybody sick. All right. Oh yeah, no one do that. People are yeah. gonna get sick. John yeah. Taffer reference. <laughs> that's what people. That, that's why we bring these people on. They want to learn um, cooking advice from us. Oh wow! Well, but, yeah, that a, that is expensive. Oil. Yeah, but Matt, oh. that cinefoil is huge. Like I have a small, like I have a small roll that's like literally this big, and it's mm -hmm. in a box, like like aluminum foil is. How much so is the can... cinefoil, Chris? It's twelve inches by twelve feet is thirty bucks. Twelve yeah. feet. You know, I'm something of a cinefoil myself. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that was good, Yambo. That was really good. That was nice. Really good. nice, nice. Well done, Yambo. Well done. <laughs> you did it. Uh, Chris, click, click next. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know what's cool about this? Too, just one, one thing. In the back, yep. there's a camera. I like that. Once it's once you shoot is right. Yeah, one one roll can last your lifetime. So you don't need to. You don't. You're not going to rebuy a bunch of stuff. So. Yeah. See what I asked. Oh, oh my god. That. Oh, that's cool. And now he's Spider Man. <laughs> Ash was that little that nub in the nub in the waistline. I'm just stop looking at it. Little weird. Stop looking at it. It's really weird. Look, you, oh, you, now you, he's tipping like, his head. It's weird. Like, why are you looking at it? Why are you looking, bud? <laughs> why are you looking? Why is it so tight, Ash? Jeez. It's a child. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez, Ash. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, hey, look. Gorilla. Hey, Gorilla. Underscore thirteen, and this is number five. I don't know who picked it, but I just wanted to be included. What do you think? I think it's great. I think it's awesome. I love the little music notes coming off of it. Oh yeah, it's that's cool. So touch. Cool. That's it's a cool touch. The music notes, the uh the bokeh in the back. Yeah, and Nilla Grill's in the chat. He says a oh, woo hoo. So there you go. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, he did an excellent job keeping the glare off of this Lego figure because that's notoriously the issue is that they're glossy toys. Yeah. And Maybe I'll be he used it. black foil. Maybe he did. Maybe he did. I will be honest. Feet of black foil <laughs> for forty dollars. No, um, I know <laughs> that all all Lego figures come with that cup hand, but for some reason, the way this picture is, my brain registers this this figure doing this, like doing the like <laughs> the rock oh, on. Like, yeah, it's just, yeah. It like Lego figures don't have figures fingers, but like for some reason, it just registers him doing that. So yeah. Uh, Jeremy, friend of the show. I'm done. Uh, oh, sorry. Did send <laughs> photos. Oh my gosh. Uh, what's the story behind good. your picture? We did a Lego week on my featured site, Toy Shot Sightings. A while back, I had won the Spider Punk minifig along with a Miles uh, Morales and Spot in a raffle on Instagram. Hmm. I figured it would be a good time to pull them out and finally get a shot done with them. I wanted to make it look like that he was at a big concert. So I added the crowd reflection in the eyes. Oh, cool. Wow. Look at wow. that. That is neat. 
and the musical notes and the Photoshop along with the bokeh. Oh, he added the bokeh? Oh, he cool. The bokeh. Nilla, since you're in the chat, I want to know what is this punk figure set from? Or is it a custom? Good question. Like, I think it's uh, unlicensed. Oh. <laughs> the kind so, you find at a con. It's, oh, guess. it's like one of those? Oh, okay. Mm. The lighting what is, is what always... This three. I don't know. Not Lego, just just brick, brick, uh, just brick. Not, not brick, brick something. Brick. Just <laughs> not brick. Don't bring brick something back. We'll be on for another hour. <laughs> it's a it's custom a... figure oh. from Minnie's Mini Figs Me. Mini okay. Figs Me, got it, got it. They have an IG page. Thanks, Noah. <laughs> the lighting's always a little trickier with Legos compared to action figures, and I was happy to make it work. <laughs> What's making you happy in the toy community right now? I have. Um, as always, the continued support and positivity that war, uh, goes along with being in this community, it's nice having something positive to look forward to on social media compared with typical negativity it can be, you can bring um, on with so many, compared to the typical neg nev negativity okay, it can you bring it. on with so many occasions. Thanks to everyone who supports each other here in our own little world. Chris, you, I'm not even 11 o'clock yet. You should still have your <laughs> normal energy pump in. I know, that's great. He did say in the beginning he got on hinge, so I was just chalking this up to he's had a couple of whiskeys. <laughs> I did. See? Yeah, you got you. Let's move on. Number four. Good job. There you go. That was great. Nice. Giovanni. Penga bean. Penga bean. <laughs> let's go oh we're, we lost macho um yeah let's uh what do we think about ryu did you did you guys call him ryu or ryu I growing up was ryu, ryu. Growing yeah up was I, ryu. Called him, I called him ryu up until we started talking about jade toys and i went oh it's ryu oh. that's what i'm saying i and you know when when, it, when it's june from jada when he's pronouncing yeah. it i assume that's right i'm just gonna yeah. say oh, yeah yeah nearly four years of ignorance right here <laughs> <laughs> not ignorance we didn't know I mean, like, is it ignorance you like and so i always associate all right i'm not to go off for else i always associate ignorance of like I'm pronouncing it Ryu, and somebody goes, "It's Ryu." No, I'm going to pronounce it Ryu. That's ignorance, right? Like sure. actually not knowing. Right. Feels like I, you just didn't have you didn't have the information. I so, feel yeah. like I have, I've had this conversation with my brother before, and I, I just assumed he was wrong. I'm like, no, it's Ryu. Yeah. <laughs> it's your but he said Ryu. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. <laughs> have none of you seen the animated movie? I like years ago. We were young. I don't know. How'd they yeah. say it in the live action? Machu, how was are it you in the chat? But not in the thing. Never mind. Yeah. You know what? Never mind. Machu, I have seen the animated Machu movie. Machu loves being in the chat. He left. He does. <laughs> he left he his does. own show yeah. to be in the chat. Yeah. 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 That's fine. That's mm. willful ignorance. I don't even know to look it up to find out. Never mind. All right. Just right. All right. move on. Move on. <laughs> Ryu. <laughs> I don't think that's Giovanni. Like yeah, go to Giovanni. <laughs> Giovanni did a great shot with Ryu. Yeah, fantastic shot. There's actually one of those uh, hashtag foes that we featured, and uh, did love that I got some spotlight. We don't have answers though. Okay. Oh, okay. Not this week, but um, I do love the little plant, the the, the plants, plants. Mm -hmm. like the plants. Yeah, yeah. We got no. Uh... No, since his name is Giovanni, we got no uh, Pichka deal sticking out like we did with John Claude Van Damme. So you're good. Good on that. So nice. <laughs> All right. Well, let's move on to number three. It's a great shot, by the way. It's a great shot. Um, Dead Spider Toys. Oh. Uh, Dead Spider Toys may be one, the account that has been featured most in the top 10. Probably. I did nominate this one because I love this. Photo. Well, you love their work. <laughs> Again, it's all. Well, I mean, every every spider shot is spectacular. Sorry, so Chris. <laughs> good. No, it's so good. Like these are clearly what I like about this is clearly figures, but they pose them so well. Yeah. Um. That it, they look like like humans, sort of. Amazing. Anyone yeah. else? No, it's really. I love the uh, layering on this, and I'd be be curious to know if it was all like. 
did they do three separate shots or did they do oh. just mm. one shot? Because the, mm. I think the layering looks great, but like all three are in focus. So I know, yeah, you know, that's, that's tough. Um, so, but it looks great. I think it's great. So Ex excellent posing, especially like personality specific too. Yes. Like I feel like they definitely all match up really well. Yeah. A little behind the thing. scenes. <clears throat> so, oh, there you go. One at a time. With the hands. Very cool. With the hands. Interesting. Nice. Never really guess that. That's crazy. See? And then but that goes back to like what we were talking about earlier with like you got that one. right. Usually you got. Ooh, look, look at for that this one. being nominated next week by Chris. Uh yeah. So I immediately did nominate another photo that I saw, not realizing he was in our top ten. <laughs> nice. Because this one's all separated. And look at that. Yeah. Nicely done. No, and by the way, like no, you know, no crazy gimmicks, no crazy things. Like, hey, hand pick, took three hand picks and put them together and did the work. Like, use what you got. Don't get pressured into buying something. Lost in translation photos here. Hey, hey, Jules. Hey, how's it going? Hi there. Hey, Jules, Marcia. I see you in our chat. <laughs> uh, we do have some answers from. Um... Uh, Dead Spire Toys for number one story behind the photo. I was inspired by a post on the Hot Toys page where three spiders appear around the city in similar poses. I thought it was really cool and wanted to make my own version. And for what's making them happy in the toy community today, I'm currently loving the hype around X Men. I find myself, I've, I myself hadn't followed the classic series because I was born later and I'm loving the new one. And I'm buying several X Men. I'm very happy. Have a blessed week. You too. You too. You too, Dead Spider Toys. Take it easy, buddy. Let's move on. New <laughs> Speaking of, oh, this one hits hard. <sighs> Can't watch. Seriously, this wrecked this me. Hits hard. Wrecked. No, everyone, shut it. <laughs> let's just let's just take a moment. Not this picture. Let's just think about it. That's it. And then we'll move on. <clears throat> so don't forget, everybody, that a couple of weeks ago we had previously on X-Men hosted by Machu Toy Between Two Sentinels. And uh, I think it's coming back again this weekend. <laughs> it has to. Because if we don't talk about it. We need to talk about this. Spoilers I, episode. I took yeah. notes and I have like thoughts and no. um, I'm ready Wait, to I report on them. You and you and Chewy today with the thoughts. Jeez. Turn the phone off. All the thoughts. I just put three <laughs> dots in bluey sitting in the wheelbarrow thinking No. I was making a th thoughts. The thoughts? Is that how you say it? Yeah. Thoughts? Thoughts. Yeah, I think that's how you say it. Thighs and thoughts. Thighs and thoughts. It's me and John's newest uh, YouTube yeah. show. YouTube show. What's up, Cindy? I go away for Canada for just a couple days. This is what happens. Dude, you literally the day you were gone, the earth shook. Okay, like yeah, I, I don't want to say it's all your fault, but it's all your fault. You there was an eclipse country. when I came back. Yeah, oh, the, yes. yeah. So the Earth shook when you left, and then we had to block out the sun to bring you back. I mean, yeah. initially we thought it was because of Yimbo's bowels, but it's really you. Yeah. I get mm -hmm. it. Yeah, yeah, Machu. Tell me you don't have a god complex. I have a god complex. Okay. <laughs> <sighs> this uh, shot. Um, it's a great shot. It's a great shot. It's a heavily emotional shot. Um, I don't know. I'm just Yin Keat 0675. I'm just taking over at this point. Uh, <laughs> just, it's, it's, I love the, uh, you know, the, I love the foreground being out of focus so that you're really focused on, uh, on Rogue. And there's the subtleties there too, right? Like that is Rogue's ungloved hand. Um, mm -hmm. As we learned as to why we can, why they can touch. Specifically in this episode, but if you are your, uh, you know, uh, an X Men fan, you know why that can happen. But I love it; it's great. It looks, you know, it's just really good. It's really well done. Also, love the lighting, like how it's uh, hitting certain assets of the rogue. Assets, <laughs> yeah. Like I said, a lot of thought talk. <laughs> Yeah. And Thoughts? then even the Thoughts. light in it's very comic book, very X Men series that Magne, the room that Magnus is walking into has no lights. But that's yeah. exactly what the show would be. Like, yeah, he's walking into darkness basically. Mm. 
or just the room like, full of candles. Very foreshadowing, right? She's, you know, not, and this has nothing to do with this, this show tonight, but or the show from the other night, but like just the characters themselves. He's walking into darkness while she walks out into the light. Mm-hmm. Very nice. See, storytelling. You got it. Guy watched like one it. WrestleMania. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Long term stories. Long term hey, stories. Tell us about Seth Rollins, John. Just just bring us up to speed. I'm your <laughs> shields. I'll be your shields. <laughs> Guy's really selling the uh, can't walk out of this ring. <laughs> do we have uh, answers? We do not have answers, unfortunately. Um, but doesn't take away from this photo. Please give this uh, account a visit and uh, give a follow if you like what you see. Awesome. Good job. And let's oh. go to number one. Oh, who's, we know this who's this up and coming photographer? Never heard of him before. But... <laughs> I heard he's a real jerk. <laughs> I hear <laughs> he he's done some amazing photos with these turtles. Like yes. amazing. Absolutely. And he has the longest Instagram name imagine. Oh my god. Yes, yeah. he does. <laughs> really kind, very talented photographer. Not very yeah, not playing photography. He's the best. He's the best. We can't even joke about how mean he is because he's just such a he's such a nice guy. Yeah, he's he is. such mm-hmm. a nice guy. He really it's... is. Sully, you killed this man. Yeah. This is Great. really spectacular. And I do like again the, the kit bashing. Yeah. And now is this because I'm not familiar with TMNT three? I still haven't gone back to. I went to two. I did watch Secret of the Use recently, like within the last couple of weeks. So three is up on one of my late night playing with toys. So are you asking if there this was a scene from? Toys? Yeah. No. Oh wow. Uh, I think he just made it. Yeah, but no. To your point of the kit bashing, right? I mean, these are the Mezco turtles mixed with the uh, armor and the. Uh, oh. What would you call that? Uh, not a jacket, but we get tunic, tunic, yeah, maybe tunic. Um, not a bolero, but yeah, um, of the uh, the team in T3. Um, I love the pop eyes, like, pop, sorry, pop in the eyes, not pop yeah. eyes. I love the pop in the eyes there. A pop eye um, school, too. Pop eye school, but yeah, you know, re release pop eye mess. Um, uh, but the pop <laughs> in the eyes there is nice to really bring it on. I want to know where you got the caterpillar. Is that like a figure? Is that like a fake thing? Is yeah, a, I. We have to check his account because Sully's the type of guy that will use real life He's animals here, and insects. I know, I know, but yeah. is that real? He's behind is it him. real, Sully? Oh, yes, yeah, I assume it's real. real. I don't. Well, I think it's real. I just don't think he. I think he photoshopped that in. No, but I, yeah, yeah. But I like, it, took the photo. It, I don't know. I just, oh, you think he took the photo? Yeah, of the caterpillar and then added it. He found the tiniest caterpillar. It's Photoshop. Okay. It's Photoshop. Okay. But is it Photoshop over real caterpillars? Yeah. Right? Did you take the photo of the caterpillar? The <laughs> we'll pause for you to answer. Is this a? Is this an actual insect? Tell us. We need to know. Hold on, he's typing. I mean, we're not moving on until we, we get the answer. He also said he was like 15 seconds behind. I know, that's why he's, he's typing the answer. Oh. Uh, I, T, space bar, A. That's how I type. I'll give you a pop in the eye. It's Come a on. real caterpillar. We have tons oh, of them. Okay. There. Oh, okay. So oh, he did. Okay. Oh, you have tons of those? Yeah. What I, might I tell want you. To get checked out. Um, Yikes. We'll see the doctor. So, <laughs> you know. It's a great shot, though. A beautiful shot. There. And for those unaware, he, he has his own show as well, Behind the Plastic, with um, two also very talented, very kind people, TMNT 1987 and Sequential Plastic, uh, posting videos at least once a week with a guest. I think um, it was there twice a week. Did Sequential Plastic shave his mustache yet? Speaking know. of caterpillars, he's got a lip caterpillar. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we do have some answers, of course, because, you know, it's Sully. Um, for the story behind the photo, it was part of a collab where we wanted to use the Mezco Turtles and the NECA Movie Turtles 3 in NECA Movie Turtles 3 gear. And I recently gone on a walk and saw a caterpillar and wanted to include that in the photo. I asked him some other questions because he's been featured before. Uh, favorite fig of all time is Mezco Vaporoni. He seems to have unlimited mm. uses. Favorite food and thing to cook are one and the same. I love pizza, and I make a great barbecue chicken pizza all from scratch. Wow. Uh, Mutant power. 
he w- would have. Um, he says, I might have to go with Magneto's powers. Seems the most versatile. You can move things, fly, etc. And the last thing is always what's making them happy in the toy community. The thing that is making me happy these days is hanging out with friends more and getting to know others better. Fantastic, Sully. Thank you. Fantastic photo. Yeah. All the smiles. All the smiles. That's what that brings. A lot of joy, that photo. I am the biggest so coaster. happy right now. It is 1040. I was gonna say, and we just finished. Finish. I'm going to go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> we need a laser man update, really. I mean, what, what was your most recent custom? There's no update, but I there 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 is someone in the chat that's working on something with me. So the update is that there's no update. I love that. Have you started shipping out your villains? Shipping them, shipping them out to photographers. Uh, no, to mm. Emily though. Yeah, <laughs> to get drawn up as real GI like, Joe characters. You want some ideas? Here you go. You may already have some of these bucks. You know what Joes need? Mutated farm animals <laughs> and a farm dio. Haystacks. That's what the I- kids want. If we could just get a cow accessory in one of those, like I'm, I'm happy. We did we, it. We do. Do we want to talk about the um, exclusive first ever Marvel Legends vehicle that was released and announced this week? Oh yeah. Okay. What are you talking about? What was it? We want, we're talking about. It came in the two pack. Yeah. It's it was a, a queen jet. It was affected by pin particles. Yeah. It's the yeah. first. It's the first ever. It's the first Marvel Legends vehicle. First ever. It's a one twelve twin jet. You know. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Uh, messy photography has a question. Um, should he pick up the Meister Union Fury Planet Veteran Williams exclusive? I didn't know that was out. Um, yeah, you should. Yes, because it's like three figures in one, and I love it. And it's yeah. probably the definitive werewolf if you need a werewolf. You know, backstory of Toy Father. I'm surprised how much he how how deep his love for werewolves go. It's like <laughs> I love I loved Silver Bullet when growing up. That was like a movie I watched all the time. For some reason werewolves were like my favorite monster. Have you shot werewolf? him yet? Uh, no, I have not shot him. Oh, I think meant like he's like <laughs> those figures hurt too. Like you, the you have uh you're not selling uh, me on this figure. The Wang <laughs> figure, right? I I, le- I do like the figure because it's like again. Good thing the Wang are... isn't sharp. Um, that one that one hurts. <laughs> Does it? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Does anyway? So uh, you know, yeah. it's not sharp. Uh, Wang. Because you're not putting enough lotion on it. <laughs> I said it. You you did. Uh, team no heat. Um, <laughs> <laughs> what did you do? She started smoking. Like, slow down. All right. All right. Um, uh, Trevor has a question. Did everyone see the Joker trailer this week? Yes, I did. Yes, I, did. I did not, but I I saw people upset about it. Oh, I upset about it. People were upset by it. Well, that's going to be some sort of musical. Yeah, it's a it's musical. Well, yeah, I mean, they, they've known it's been a musical. Book. If they're still upset about yeah. this, they have nothing else to be upset about. No, I know. So I, I, you know, I'll see it. But I'm, I'm not down with people that are anti-musicals. Um, if you guys want to be upset about something, why don't you be upset about the fact that I still haven't seen the first Joker? Uh, me too, John. I haven't seen it. I, hey, right. Oh, all right, cool. There it we just go. didn't look appealing good. to me. The second one now that's a musical. I might watch that. Fantastic! I'm calling it Haha ha Land. That's good. I like that. That's, good. <laughs> That's actually really good. That's really good. And uh, yeah, and one six shooter giving out careful advice. You got to be careful when gripping that way. <laughs> be yeah, I only I only saw the first Joker movie once. I mean, it was really it was really good, but it's also oh, like you have same. to be in. It's a it's a trip. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's what like it feels like. It's one of those movies where it's like, going to stress you out. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I don't need more stress right now. Right. Yeah, it's stressful. Yeah. yeah. I just watched it once too. That's you know, fine. Yeah. Yeah. We could do a watch party since the three of us haven't watched it. You guys only watched it once. Well, yeah, we'll watch that Legion's Con. Yeah. Oh, I like that mm. idea. And then we can go see the movie. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let's yeah. do that. There you go. Cool. 
I'd rather watch Bloodsport. We could do that too. Uh, it's a long weekend. Sort of yeah, thing. We'll, we'll do that too, Chris. But I'm falling asleep <laughs> within the first five minutes. Bloodsport? Yeah. How? Okay. I don't. I don't like it. It's, it's, I, don't know. I don't like it. I don't like it. I saw it once. It's, it's too violent. Like it. I don't like it. I'm not doing YouTube. I just like it's always been like I don't like it. <laughs> like my kids eat the broccoli. I don't like it. You know? No, I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't like it. I'm tired. Just, he's just gonna go. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> just like. You go off the deep end on that last one. <laughs> what, like, like you, you watch it and you're like, oh, my life isn't that bad. Yeah, yeah. So like, oh, no. At least I'm not running around killing people, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Do we have a feature pass? Ooh. Um, We can. I I just ask. Cause... Give the people what they want. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I only say it because last week no one wanted it. <laughs> That's true. That's true. No, no one wanted it, but you problem. gave it out three times. You did. Yeah, you did. I saw it. <laughs> I think didn't Toy Father already give the pass, or no, true, you already gave the pass. This uh, to killing spider guy or whatever it is, he's already in for next week. <laughs> oh. Well, it's not that not a given that it will get nominated, but yeah. Here's here's next week's hashtag. What's your new sharp wing? Well, going back. <laughs> nice. You should have made. You should have put it as a rem, remember it. Uh, oh, remember your that would've been good. Remember, no one's remember your wing? Yimbo, how do you like that, Ken? <clears throat> I really love this this these head sculpts. The smiling Ken. It's, it's fantastic. Oh wait! Did you guys see? Speaking of Ken Hensel, did you guys see the uh, what you call it? The um, uh, the player two colors that come with alternate head sculpts? Oh what? Wait oh, yeah, for was, for Ken? Yeah. For like well, they uh, showed Ken, Phelan, Chun Li, and uh, Ryu that they're going to be deluxe figures. Oh, they're really? Come with alternate head sculpts and like uh, like like well, I think one of them is an oil can. Like battle damage stuff. Oh wow! What's the uh, Ken alternate color? Isn't that evil Ken? I don't know. It's those, an alternate those, color. Those are those, those are all like leaks before, I believe. Now they so they're not, are they not official. Am I not supposed to talk about them? No, no. Now they can. I guess they confirmed yeah. it now. Violent Ken. Violent Ken. Well, there. I don't I mean, know what it is. All I know is I'm just Ken. Oh, yeah, you are. And anywhere else, I'd be a ten. <laughs> Ken Deluxe. I kind of miss the Jay's Hot bit you used to do. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to bring it back. Don't worry. It's, 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 but that's the thing. Like People need to miss it before people are like, mm. oh, it's getting weird now. He's like talking about, yeah, I don't know. We'll bring it back. Hasn't stopped it. laser, man. Just keep it going. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you, you, you always set me up. So. I know, but I'm one of the people that loves it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. I just if you're gonna send figures out to people to shoot, I want Heyman. Heyman? All right. Yeah, I want Heyman. I want him. He's he's pretty good. I mean, everyone wants um the Mooderin. So yeah, who gets it man. first? The Amazing I, Mitchell I Wu. Are, do you use actual hay on Heyman? Yeah. Yeah. I have like a whole. I have like two big packages of just hay. So. Hay fever. Would you let us do like Sir Dork type photography with Heyman or no? On fire. Oh. As long as you're not near a building. <laughs> <laughs> hey, don't you restrict art? Yeah, really. <laughs> I, just, I just want to make sure Machu is, you know, safe. We'll we can't safe, we right? can't put cinefoil in the oven. We can't light fires near buildings. What does the show third, become? My friends, safety third. Safety first. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, nothing can stop Laser Man. That's right, Fix <laughs> Fix. The mirror. Blast nothing can stop the Noids. <laughs> the Noid. Oh, the Noid should come back. The Noid should be the next Jada figure. 
Ooh. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting for a highly articulated, like not the not not for what's his name, not the guy. From not the Adam. Show, but, yeah, not Adam, <laughs> but like a, a a really super articulated Kool Aid man. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you could store all the oh. all the accessories in the in the. Get him. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> I only have the, I have the Funko one that I that I use, and that's not articulate whatsoever. But that's like the closest one that comes close to like looking like it. Fantastic! <laughs> well, copyrights might stop like that. <laughs> so Very true. true. I well, mean, three out of three out of three, three out of five Hasbro people know about it. It's okay. Clint had a great idea just to change <laughs> the all design. Of them have of, said uh, the same Lisa thing. <laughs> It's not even just the design; it's the name. It's it's the exact figure. <laughs> um, Clint had a good way of. Uh, he's like, it should be a, a, an armor full of uh, milk buckets. I was like, okay, I'll, 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 like that should be milk buckets. Oh, yeah. oh my god! Like I, the first one is made out of milk buckets, and I'm that's him high. with an with like an anvil and uh, a hammer. And it just keeps, it just yeah. keeps cutting to cows getting nervous. And to cool off the cool off the metal, he's pouring milk onto it. <laughs> oh, that's a great idea! <laughs> love that. I love that. Perfect. Going in the notes. <laughs> Meanwhile, with the motor in that that's that's the cover you're going to try to convince Chamba to uh, to make for you. Draw. You can pay him. <laughs> like I have this vision. Think Iron Man, but think Barn. Remember thirty minutes ago when we were like, "Hey, we're going to wrap up early." Yeah. Um... Yeah. Okay. Well then, <laughs> Chris was so excited to go to bed, and then we started talking about squirting milk on on armor. Mm. <laughs> oh, that looks up, cool. Is it still early? This is still early. <laughs> oh, that's really neat. That's true. Like Last week, I think we went to um I went like up her. to twelve thirty. You like her? Yeah, she's good. That's cool. I like that effect. The body looks seamless too, like the, with the articulation. I mean, it it's Yama, it's old Yamaguchi. Oh, before they started getting crazy, and then where you they're now really circling the back. Hmm. You can really see the ball joints on this one. <laughs> Her hair is articulated too. Oh, oh really? That's neat. Oh. That's a really I don't know, I pretty good bigger more than I thought. Wow. Did you see? Um, was it Patrick Chow has uh, head sculpts for Catwoman? Yeah, for as a black cat. Yeah, yeah. I might have to hold on to that extra one. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Embo. That's okay. I still have. You still have somewhere. <laughs> Hobby gank. I don't know. I never sent my message. I'm still waiting for them to just <laughs> get all of those. Those are going to be fun summer toys to come in eventually. I never opened up my uh, Poison Ivy, my Mafex. I have like, yeah, I, I have quite that. a few Mafex figures to open. But I think the one I'm going to open next is Gambit. Cool. I love Gambit. Mon ami. Mon ami. I am Gambit. Name's Gambit. Mon ami. Do we just want to talk about it? Just like nope. whoever had to watch nope. it. Uh... <laughs> nope. <laughs> Save it. So what the hell are we going to talk about on Saturday? I'm gonna I'm gonna click this. We're drawing. No, I got, I'm definitely cracking that open. I think that's gonna be my next uh, toy. Now that I unboxed Ken and and Bison and Dulcine yeah. tonight. Oh, what do you think about M Bison? That's the one I'm. I want to get. He's <laughs> sick. He's awesome. That that freaking cape, man. That wire cape is awesome. They Ken, all move well. They all move well. Ken or M Bison? Well, Ken is Ken. I I have I have Ryu and Evil Ryu, so like he's the same figure, yeah. body wise, but obviously with different paint, which is awesome. But you know, M Bison is just he's a beast compared to the rest of them. Toy Father, did you ever get the SHF M Bison? I didn't. I came very close to it, but I have Ken and Vega, uh, and then I stopped there. Yo, I really like this cape though. This, oh, cape, damn, this cool. cape is sick. Whoa, yeah. really? Yeah, Seriously? like it actually. It's it's interesting. Like, but it 
po look, it's oh my god, this has been bad. So good next to the Chun Li I have back here. Oh my <laughs> god. Okay, buddy. You should yeah. go get that Chun Li. Uh, it, there's a lot of stuff you don't see. It's oh, blocking yeah. the yeah. detail from opening. It, it's in it's in the cart with your Epic all in. So yeah, it's it's, it's, <laughs> it's, it's right next to an Epi Pen. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I oh man, I didn't know that cape was. Oof. I'm going to I'm going to give I'm going to give this cape its flowers and the only th I'm I'm not I I obviously own these other toys I'm going to talk about but this is a nicer cape in terms of posing than my last couple of like Mezco wired capes. Mm -hmm. mm. And for articulation no issues with this one. It's all good. Like look at it. like yeah, he can like crunch no down. Duds. Mm. Yeah, smooth. I think this is the one that's going to be the great. soft, the and soft skirt, so you can get all the stuff. And chunk. I could have him fight some of my Power Rangers because he did that once. Really? Yeah. Oh, in the comic? Um, no, in the video game. Uh, and then they um, made a short mm. as well, a live action short. Don't they have a? Don't they have a comic now? Street Fighter vs. Power Rangers. Oh, do they really? Oh, I, don't know. I think Power Rangers do something. I know they're doing a Godzilla, but I think there's another one too. Hmm. Yeah. By the way, shout out to our boy Henrock One Twelve, right, Macho? You you, uh, you you clued me into that in one of our chats today. Yep. Um, he was. They, Jada reposted one of his photos, mm -hmm. the Duart Dio, yeah. and it was Bison versus Chun Li. Six That's shot awesome. by Henrock. That's awesome. But uh, yeah, this is not the Jada. <laughs> this was just on my desk. Oh. Here's the Jada. <laughs> oh, okay. oh man, he looks he does look really good. I think I like the Jada more. Yeah, I got a shiny. The, I mean, is is that yeah. easy to find the bison, uh, the Jada bison? Um, I mean, I had a little help. Same. With from some somebody friends. in the chat, you know you Same. are. Same. Mm. Sweet man, sweet boy. Freaking Jersey connections. <laughs> what do you mean Jersey <laughs> connections? This we know we know people. He's, he's Arizona. Oh, he's Arizona. Arizona. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. He's raising it. Sorry. I think y'all right. need to shut your mouths right now. <laughs> oh, this is Jersey boy. Oh, um. <laughs> Let's see. Is do you like Dalsim? Oh, don't see him. I didn't. I didn't do anything with him except what? try to get the prayer hands going. The bend. They are bendy legs and arms. I just gotta have fun with them. Yeah. Um. He's got also nice big feet too. So again, all of these characters. Are, he, he's got a tinier waist. Again, a lot of great flexibility out of him. He's cool. They're all cool. I'm getting all of them. I'm laying on every single figure that comes out. Yep. I told you I'm an essay. I'm a Street Fighter guy over Mortal Kombat. So. Oh yeah. Totally. Oh, absolutely. I mean, that's absolutely. I'm I'm with you. I don't want to speak out of turn, but they posted um, they they, maybe I'll talk about it after the stream. I don't want to get anyone. Annoyed <laughs> right. with you guys. Um, <laughs> with, with us annoyed with us? No, no. Um, John and Machu. We don't know him. Oh. Yeah, that's us. We're shady. <laughs> We're shady. Um, I'm pushing this button. Go ahead. Push the button. I win again. Machu, whenever you want to post something, go ahead. <laughs> oh, my Rage! God. Rage! <laughs> no, that's fair. That's fair. That's fine. Give it to Sully. He's a nice guy. Wait, it's that's not even is that even him? Is that's not a bird? Not, that's true. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's, that's only half the name. Not confirmed. Yeah. Oh, you only got a certain amount of characters to type in. Okay, why did he go by Nab Nap? I will say that the, the cool thing about oh there goes an arm. As I was about to say. <laughs> broken. How far in uh, Bob's Burgers are you now, John? 
Uh, it's funny because I was just like, oh, I'm going to get Bob's Burgers as soon as we hang up. Uh, I think I'm in episode seven. What just happened? Um, they did the Easter episode where they're finding the 72 eggs. Uh, I'm on I'm season seven, episode 19. My God, I'm blowing through the show. Um, the Easter episode where they find the eggs in the wall and he finds the raccoon. Uh, yeah. Oh, King Trash more, Mouth? Nice. Yeah. More, or no, it was Princess Cupcake or something. Oh, no, Pudding, pudding Snatcher, whatever it is, because that's how they get him out. Um, you got to cop the turkey. Yeah, I get like Mort and uh, Gene, I think. Or not Mort. Uh, Teddy Teddy and Gene are my favorite. They're my absolute favorite characters of the show. Louise and Teddy. Louise and Teddy? I love Louise. Louise, Louise is funny because Louise is like literally the combination of my kids. Like if you put my kids <laughs> together, you would get Louise. Uh, but Gene, I feel like, is my inner child. Mm. He <laughs> says the all the things ridiculous. with... Just the most ridiculous things. <laughs> um, so, it's a button! Yeah, like that's that's what I, like, I want to yell out like in my head, and, you know. Or pfft, not even made of real bison. <laughs> I will say, though, that like what I like about this bison is I believe it comes with folding arms. Mm. So you can remove that was what's the missing arms. from the Jada, the folding yeah. arms. Was the folding be arms the version? We'll buy it again. And like the ankle articulation on this one on the SH is pretty good. I yeah. have Bison, Ryu, and Ken posed with uh, with the D Blake sign ready to go. I just have literally have to just hit click on the button, and that's waiting for me to when I get home. So. Trying to balance this kick without the stands because he comes with a stand that can hold up the leg. Yeah, I think I could do it, but some like every once in a while I got a little trouble with ankles. You get a little trouble getting it up. It's okay. Yeah, hmm. we're over thirty. It I know. This week's episode is sponsored by him. <laughs> Type in J Shot for ten percent off your first order. <laughs> Oh, that's awful. <laughs> no, I, I, I do not take any sponsorship. I can get. You can. Yeah. You know how many wrestling podcasts I've listened to in my life? <laughs> <laughs> hey, so Dork's here. Hey, what's going on, Jared? I'm going to pose Bison like he's over 30. <laughs> oh, I balanced him. Uh, Took a while. It took a while, but you got there. Go took ahead. a while, yeah. yeah. How's that? <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's an over 30 picture. <laughs> uh, yeah. Took a while, but if you got there, and if you're having the opposite problem, go to Hims too. Use J Shop for 20% off. That, that's us. Oh, now it's up to 20%? Wow. No, no, 20% off for the other thing. You, mm. know, so you arrived too early. <laughs> <laughs> All right, can we talk X Men? No, we're no, we're staying for Saturday. Damn it! But if you really want to talk X Men, go to hims.com and use Jason. <laughs> <Shut Mom. laughs> All right, should we do plugs and get out? <laughs> if you like plugs, go to <laughs> <laughs> type in J Shop for twenty five percent off, <laughs> or for fifty percent more plug. J you know, when you, guys, when you guys said you were up for adult toys, this is not what I thought we meant. Anyway, Sir Dark shows up, and this is what we're talking about. Go. We make. both said we weren't going to stay for the top ten. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm which on is, vacation. Which is also why I signed into this secondary account so I could control it for you guys. Yeah. You go. All right. Go. Cool. Chris is asleep. Do you have something going on this Monday? Uh, yeah. What Always are you talking about. Uh, we're going to be talking about Donnie Darko. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. So wake up. We're going to be talking about Donnie Darko. Probably talk about some X Men as always. And then um, uh, that's about it. Just hanging out. And it's a nice, tight show. That's what I like about Toy Talk. Hour and a half. Did you go right oh, is that, is that a backhand <laughs> slap to this evening? And each and every Wednesday? Not this evening. This evening is great. It's 11 it. o'clock. We're going to bed at hours. 1. <laughs> 2 minutes and 58 seconds just to make it. So, oh, yeah. Um, super so short. Probably, did you go back and watch the, uh, did you watch the Washington Post? Don Jarka? Dr. Zayas? No, no. Oh. Dr. Zayas, Dr. Zayas. Oh. Dr. Zayas. 
<laughs> no, I got I got, I got to YouTube that one though. That was yeah. that was good. That was good. Is he going? Go, <laughs> can I play the piano? And then he goes, "Yeah, I don't see why." Well, I couldn't before. And it didn't. Like it's just like great. That that was a that had to have been a Conan episode, right? Oh yeah, no, I was just yeah. gonna say that too. That was the Conan era, like because yeah. all the musical stuff was Conan. Like, yeah, 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 monorail, monorail, and yeah. all that stuff. Yeah, so. I gotta go back to Doctor Zayas. That was a good one. See my best. See my best. Um, but yes, Monday Toy Talk, uh, eight thirty, and um, check us out and just hang out. And then um, we'll have a previously on X Men on between on the Machi Toy YouTube channel sometime this weekend. I'm guessing. Yep. Uh, Yimbo, any good plans for Sunday? Uh, nothing in particular, except a good time. And uh, speaking of which, if you missed this past Sunday, uh, I hung out with Chewy and Jay Shot, and we had a blast. And it wasn't just WrestleMania theme. We actually kind of saved the wrestling talk for the main event. Like we just ended up going through toy news and Ninja Turtle talk, and I don't know. We just laughed our way until all of a sudden we were like, "Oh damn, the Rock and Cody." <laughs> yeah, we should just you think next of that match, by the way. It was great. I, I want to go back and I have to rewatch it and just to really just enjoy all of those cameos and run-ins and all that. You know, like Next really time just do a watch along. We have to um just plan to have that stream to be completely demonetized and just play the sounds. No, 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 not 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 play the sound. But I think you should play the sound in your headphones. Oh, okay. Mm. Because I was when I was watching you guys while watching this um, WrestleMania. You took forever to react to who came out. Well, yeah, because well, we, like we had we couldn't hear music. It was just went music, dark. Yeah, yeah. Like, who, like who's who's coming out now? Oh my god, yeah. Cena's in the ring. Yeah. We we couldn't <laughs> see, see him. him. Chewie was in that five second delay for a little bit. Yeah, yeah I didn't realize until like partway through that final match. Mm -hmm. Um. But uh, just so you guys know, too, out there that um, I've been, like I said, I've been cranking out as many videos as I can. I have, um, I still have to record my Donatello video, but my our boy TMNT 1987 sent me some videos. So he'll be included with some behind the plastic shout outs. And I have the Marvel Select uh, Captain America review up. And then I posted a very short, like if you have under four minutes <laughs> of your time, uh, a little toy photography lighting setup. <laughs> So yeah, I put that up uh, yesterday. Yesterday, perfect amount of time for the bathroom. Yeah, yeah. So go check it out. I try, you know, maybe 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 you'll learn a new thing. And if you have suggestions for me, I'm all ears. I have to call Agent Variant. He wanted to talk about my lighting, so I'm all. I want to learn from the from the man. So <laughs> don't be ashamed. Four minutes is a perfectly average amount of time. That's what I figured, but you know, you know. if you if you want longer, use you know. promo code JShot. <laughs> all right and then tune in uh next week wednesday for more between two sentinels starting at eight o'clock followed by um toy pick me with the toy daddies in the top 10 at nine o'clock official new time yep and the like and the comment and the subscribing and then hit that notification. And seriously, like we, we I joked about this on Sunday with you guys, but um, it's always nice to find out like, oh, you watch the stream. That's awesome. Because there you go. Yeah. Outside of our wonderful chat on across all of our shows, we love you guys so much. We appreciate the time that you take out of your lives listening to us talk about toys and toy photography and all this fun stuff. But um, yeah, it's always nice. So that helps, obviously, every like, every comment that helps uh, smaller channels out. And if you enjoy what we're doing, you know, we're trying to be be bigger. That's true. J Shot Code. Twenty six subs. Twenty percent. From... <laughs> nice. <laughs> we're twenty six subs away from a thousand, and if we can get there, it doesn't mean much. But we love we'd love to get there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It doesn't change anything, but. <laughs> Oh yeah, Jay Shot. Uh, next week is episode well, nice. Nice episode. Nice. Speaking of him, it's episode nice next week. So, bringing that energy, Jay Shot. That's episode sixty-nine. <laughs> yeah. So, I think he's talking to you. Still one of the best lines in the <laughs> Hello, Mister Thompson. I think he's talking to you. So. My favorite uh, one is when he's like, "Gaim." Uh, <laughs> yes. Oh, 
God. Oh, God. <laughs> he walks in, he literally wipes the tear from his eyes and walks out. <laughs> God. Oh, God. Oh, Jim. <laughs> or when Abe, remember, like, uh, Bart's got, like, the door hat, the, the hat check guy, and, like, Abe walks into the club, he's like, <laughs> puts his hat down, and he goes, DJ Bart just keeps spinning. And then, <laughs> they turn, the yep. And then moves the beat. Can oh we God. finally talk X Men now? Yeah, I'm talking X Men. Hit the outro. Hey, Chris, what is your favorite Simpsons episode? Well, unite my toy collectors, photographers, and more. We had some fun tonight, but we're out of pictures to explore. We thank you for your time. It was nothing but sublime. Though it's time to go to bed, don't be filled with dread. Because next week we'll be right here. Your toy daddies will appear to bring you joy and laughter every night and here on after.